You guys are so smart. No, you need to drink. Tr we're here watching you now. Drink the. Drink the drink with the beard. Is it like a plastic like beard? So it looks. No, no, no. Is it? It's actual a... fur. Not fur. No, it's okay. not fur. It's fucking. It's foam. It's oh, foam. Oh, oh. Sudden, you know. <laughs> oh, fancy. What'd you say, Woody? We're live, live. Just letting you know. Yeah. Last oh, stream well, then let me is... just get back in there. Just letting you know. Last stream <laughs> is a cosplay stream. Is that what's happening? Yes. Yeah. Everyone will cosplay as their game. Okay. I will get my tits out. Been there, done that. Dude, no. Can I put... <laughs> wait. Wait. Dario's shirtless. Well, They told you that Dario is shirtless more often than not. I mean, I have, like, a flesh tone bra on right now. Like, hey. Yeah. Call it good. <laughs> just paint on, like, the... You know... The pecs. The, the pecs. The pe <laughs> Who's to say I don't already have them, Liz? Like, the fuck? You got an 8-pack? I would love yeah, to see it. Yeah, I have a 16-pack. Oh, ah, shit. There yeah. it is. It's yeah. all revealed. Oh, and uh, my boobs are... They look like giant pecs. Are they part I of mean, that's just what boobs pack? are. You know? Uh, hello, yeah. everybody. Welcome to Face the Raisin Raven. Welcome to Anatomy. Face the Raisin! She did it again! Did it again! <laughs> <laughs> look, I don't know how to talk. Tech. Look, there's just little raisins flying through the air. Welcome to Face the Raven, a D&D &D mm -hmm. 5e homebrew campaign brought to you by me. I hope you're having a wonderful day, Shadow, and hello, K Play from another room. me. Um, where we, all these nerdy people get together and we just cause some chaos. So it's a good time. Um, wow. Quick rules as always. Please don't uh, constantly at the players. We're trying to play a game here. And also no backseating. That's all. Easy peasy. Quick recap. The party has decided after a few weeks back home in Moltra that they will be continuing on to face the dragon who is Ophius, uh, the true form of Ophius. There is a little bit of resistance from Reese, who has felt unsure, but overall the party decided it was a good move to make. Splint decided to stay back and take care of not only Timmy, but Lincoln and Ellis, who are Reese and Nickel's children. Nickel will be joining the party. I will be playing her NPC. And then in the morning, X declared that she needed to make her departure in an attempt to find her parents. And that's where we left off. Um, however, for this game, we're going to be starting in the morning um, after. So Splint has collected the children. We've said very sad goodbyes. And the party is Aren't getting they living ready in to the depart. house. Yes, but Splint took them um, back somewhere. <laughs> They're not <laughs> at the house uh, because just to make leaving actually a little bit easy for okay. Nicole and Reese. You'll sit Did on the roof. Did she cry? Who cried? Which one? Did she cry? Nicole. Or Nicole just like yeah. outside. Nicole definitely <sighs> is like quietly. So we'll we'll go ahead and correct what's going on here. You could just tell me what happened. is here just having a little cry at the kitchen. And that's okay. actually where we're going to get started. Um, and Dario's outside. <laughs> and Dario's outside. So <laughs> we're going to we're going to go ahead and start. Uh, so we'll we will start with Reese uh, played leaving. by He's Les. Go. I'm fucking fishing. What's it look just like? Fishing. Nice. Get those fishies. Uh, Reese, can oh, you describe who you are, what you're doing and hello, everything? I hey, I just said goodbye to my kids um and i feel like for once <clears throat> in my whole life i have to be like the strong one because you know usually i'm the the weak one who gets really sad about things um but i can register that this departure is difficult um for my bay, and so i'm not crying um but i'm just kind of kind of like stand with her and just i'm not gonna say anything i'm just like I'm just present in the moment. Present. Grateful that Dario is outside because, you know. Yes. Nickel likes to ruin soft moments. <laughs> Nickel is also <laughs> grateful that Dario is not there to catch her in a moment of weakness, very specifically. Um, she is, I'll introduce Nickel because she'll be a continuing NPC. She is a high elf fighter class and currently she... Um, is standing at the counter um, trying to just clean up a little bit, clean off like a stain on the counter that does not exist. She is just keeping busy. Um, 
like quiet tears just running down her face um, as she had just said goodbye to her children for the first time ever. Um, she usually does not let them in the care of anyone else. It's very rare. And she's having a hard time about it. Um, and we'll, we're going to continue around the circle here and up to Dario. So Dario, you said you're fishing. Can you tell us who you are, what you're doing? I'm fishing. Um, <laughs> it seems to be like there's there's uh, some rain happening because my face is very wet. Don't know why. Uh, <laughs> I'm just... Yeah, I'm just fishing, pondering life. Can you do a nature check for me? Well, <laughs> trying to mind my business. Uh, it is not yeah, raining. Yeah, right! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's Nicely done. It's not raining. But your face That's is funny, wet for some reason. There's, there's some drafts, I swear. I think it's just right where I'm... <laughs> you know what? It might be some, some raisin shit that hit my face or something. I don't oh, know. yeah. Those raisins, <laughs> they get you. you Those know? damn raisins. <laughs> How dare they? <laughs> All right, so Dario is uh, taking a moment to himself, just fishing, uh, seeing if he can catch any uh, wonderful salmon in the river. Uh, I don't hmm. actually have a fishing rod. You're just... You're doing all the he's motions, in, though, so you're like... No, he's, like, standing in the river. You know how dudes, like... Standing like, there manly, just... Like, you're oh, ready to oh, grab Oh, you're, like, barehandedly yeah. trying to catch a fish. Yeah, fuck yeah. He got a 20, caught a fish for sure. What do you mean? Well, no, that was just to see if it was raining. If he would Come know on. if it was. All right. How do you? But, how do we know if he caught a fish? Uh, so if you'd I'm like to try, and, are, are, are Would you like <laughs> no, to? I'm not. Okay. So then, never mind. So no catching fish. You are just standing there trying to keep busy. Totally understandable. Manly crying. Manly crying. Oh my God, everybody's crying. Yeah. Reese, you haven't said that I'm you're crying. crying. You, I'm not crying. So what are you? What are you doing right now? I already told you. I'm just vibing. You're just vibing. Well. I'm just standing so, there, so Nickel, watching the horrificness that is trying to clean a stain off a of cow that doesn't exist. So Nickel finally places the rag down, very um, almost aggressively, Jeez. and she takes okay, a breath, wow. and she uh, takes her hands and wipes off her face real quick and says, "We mm -hmm. should get going now while it is daylight." It's a great idea. We need to get as we need to start going, especially before they come back. So, where, where is Dario? Uh, I believe he's out the front pondering life. And she looks out the window to see him <laughs> on the... Uh, shirtless, I assume. Always shirtless. Always yeah. shirtless. <laughs> it's uh, one thing we haven't... <laughs> unneeded. So, Nicole makes her way out. Uh, unable to read that day. Server. Hello. I'm getting the fuck out of here. I gotta go. Is that on roll 20 or? Yeah, roll 20 just got a little funky for me, but it's I realized I didn't have the map. There we go. Are there ravens in the tree? I'm going inside. So oh. Yeah, I can't see anyone else move theirs. I'm going to refresh. We're moving. Uh, We're vibing. Well, Les is probably like single handedly where he is because she's like moving all over the place. Yeah. Can you just can stop you see moving me move? Okay, still yeah, I can see you move. <laughs> okay. No, nope, I got it. I okay, go. I got it. I got it. Okay. I thought you were coming to see me. Yes. I was. I thought we were leaving. Yeah. So, Reese, are you going to see Dario? Aren't we leaving? Yes. So, Nickel had come out Dario's towards the front right here. there. I thought I this was the door. I you guys. <laughs> the door, there's a door right here and a path and everything. What oh, the fuck is, is this? Thing? There's a Time back door. Ah, oh, that's the front door. I thought this was like a false door. Okay, not gonna lie, anyway. I thought that was the front door the whole time. <laughs> we got this collectively. Face the raisin. There's <laughs> face the raisin. Here you are. Oh. Hell yeah. Um. So, uh, Nickel does start to approach and says, uh, "Dario, are you ready to leave soon?" Um. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. You. Are you all right? Of course. What, what kind of question is that? No question. Like, look at look at me. Mel's not hot. Ready to go. Yep. <laughs> but I do. I do want to say something to you guys. Yes. And I, I walk in a little close, God. especially in front of a uh, nickel, not not Reese. Cause... Oh wow! <laughs> and I just say I I know what it's like to have to leave your kid behind. 
I want you guys to know that. And Nickel looks at your tear-stained face. You're laughing. <laughs> and you is she considers a slightly aggressive thought um before settling with thank you. Um but we'll all be back to our children soon. I won't. You won't. You guys don't know this, but I had to leave my son for a reason. And I know everyone thinks I'm a piece of shit, but it had to be done this way. So I know what it's like. But at least you two get to come home to your fucking kid. Are you not planning to come home? I'm planning to come home. I can't come home to Tim. Well, let's, uh, perhaps we should talk about this on our way. Okay. Because <laughs> Nickel does not look impressed by that answer at all. <laughs> uh, well. What a, this is going to be a good adventure. It'll be, it'll be quite what a great lovely. dynamic. What a great dynamic. <laughs> uh, you all wanted to get something from the market before we left. Now is yeah, the we're time. Yeah, we got to this chick named Yosh. Yeah, Where's she at? We're looking for Yosh. We're, we're looking for Creaky, Creaky Allen, <laughs> the, the fucking uh, tall ass elf motherfucker, and Yosh. Yosh, the, the woman you stole from last time you were here, and no, I no, had yeah, yeah. to. We, we told, told you that. that. What we are you talking about? I had to. Very kindly apologize Wait. on your absurd behavior because she recognized you and she uh, gestures to Reese and she, like you can tell the tension is building in the line of her jaw and came to me over how you're causing such a ruckus in there. Hey, first of all, she tried to fuck me. So let's all just calm down. Like she was lady. very. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? And the Dario keeps by defense, and that's why she must be mad. Um, she threw and, that book at us. Yep. We just we caught paid, it and left. And we and we paid for that book. So there's no thieving here. We're she all tried good. to strike Reese in the head. I saw it with my own two eyes. My own eyes, mate. Why would you want to go back there then? <laughs> the prices, what do you mean? I only mean, paid a dollar for that book. What is this? She by the way, did Splint leave that uh, book behind? Um, Graham's Fairy Tales? Oh. I. Well. I believe that he. Uh, they intended to keep it with them to read the boys. But however, the fuck are we going to hear stories? Well. A quite popular book. Perhaps we can get another copy. Yeah, from Yarch. We know. Yeah, let's go. Let's go find Yarch. <laughs> Wait, where's X? Where's. Oh shit, oh. she left. Yeah, Dude, I had a rough left. night. I was drunk as fuck. That's fine. It is quite clear that you were. Okay. I mean, I, I found myself last night. <laughs> and it wasn't couch. in the arms of a woman. Okay. For once. <laughs> well, that oh, man. is impressive. Or a troll. Or a goblin. Or orc. Or that little half person. I don't know. Don't know what it was quite. Half person, like a half halfling? person, yeah, half li that that sounds about right. It's about yay high and man, the mouth on that one. And Nickel proceeds like to start to walk vacuum away. Cleaner. <laughs> Nickel proceeds to walk away as you all start making. She going. We're back leaving. The house. What the fuck? Down. Are we going out the get... back door? Uh, she she, she her gathers ideas. her things. And you all find yourselves in the market yes! here. <laughs> oh shit, sure. shit's broken! Yes, many yeah, things are no. broken and falling apart. Uh, unfortunately, there had been um, a dragon attack and many of the markets are actually under um, construction and closed down. What the um, fuck? Everyone we have to say gosh. You do, Dario you has do? like 800 weapons to sell. Roll initiative? What? No. <laughs> <laughs> With advantage? Let's go. Um, but you do, you do recognize Yaja's shop, actually, and it's this one that Reese is standing in front of. Um, this one? Yes. Yaj! So it's full of shit. No, no, remember, Dario, it's full of stuff. Don't knock shit over again, and if we go at this correctly with a plan, we can get out with something really good. 
okay, okay. So as so you, all you just enter, give me the code and I'll make a distraction. You all actually notice that it is not full of things, as many things as it used to be. Yash? Why she's been fine? What Excuse me. Fuck? Yash? I was working with what I kid. Yeah. Yash, we and, see you got help with your hoarding addiction. And you see this uh, gnome woman who is older, still wearing very similar overalls, and just uh, on the counter just trying to put together a, a few um, like broken pieces. She looks up and she's like, Oh god, I've already had enough destruction done today. Okay. This is this this is Yash, right? Yes. Why is Yash. she so hot? <laughs> what can I, just I was working <laughs> with what I had for my tokens. Like I heard Les ask, but it, I still didn't what shit, okay. I'm sorry I broke character. It's okay. <laughs> So, oh, Yash! Look at her older. Dario needs to sell all his weapons. Yash, I've got, I've got items for you. Items for days. Oh, you. And you... I, I pull out my sack of, my, my bag, <laughs> of items. <laughs> all right. Oh well, you know, I'm lacking on inventory. So, what do you got for fuck? me? As you can you, see, Yash... that damn dragon cleared out quite a bit of my mm. stuff. I've got four, three longbows. Three long, Jesus. Three longbows wow. for you, Yash. At a at a nice price of one hundred and forty gold, they can be yours. And instantly, Yash laughs and says, "All right, take your business somewhere dead. else. Take your business somewhere else." Okay, Sorry. Yash, let's let's do this differently. How long <laughs> bow costs offer? fifty fucking gold pieces for me I to sell? I said one hundred and forty for three. You. Tr- <laughs> you sweet, sweet woman. What's going? What am I? Did I say your shop what, looks very happening? nice? What? What? What am I looking at? What's in this corner? That corner, there are many books. Um, most oh, of them are unorganized, and uh, some of some of the titles are upside down. What? what what's in this corner? Hold on, we gotta continue selling things. Well, Here. I'm doing this while they're I shout to, yes. to Reese to look out for a uh, another gr- a copy of Grimm's Fairy Tales. Okay, yeah. and that's the code. I'm ready. No, that wasn't the code. That I just mean, <laughs> like, find another copy. <laughs> I mean, I'll try to find a copy if you want. Okay. You're saying 100 and, 140 gold pieces for three for all, longbows. For all three, you'd be making two, 10 gold when you sell them. Three used longbows. Okay, okay, Yash. 100, 100 gold for three. That's 33 gold. 33.3333 gold a piece. Roll persuasion. That's a good fucking order I need to persuade for. Come on, Yaj. Oof. He says, why don't we, instead of fussing with those, uh, those extra threes you got going on there, why don't just 90 gold pieces for the three? Okay, right. you got a deal, Yaj. All right. So I'm going to hand over Holy my shit. three longbows. Now, Yaj, now. I've got a nice javelin I'm going to throw in for three for you. Oh well, thank you. Yeah, because you know the this town's gone to shite, and uh, yeah, I just want it you to have has. exactly. I, I feel like your accent's been changing, y'all. Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> you might be having a stroke. Do you want to sit down? <laughs> just take a breath. Take a breath, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I had tea in my mouth, and I couldn't. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, uh, don't worry about it. <laughs> Sus. All right. Okay, Yaj, I've got I've got three long swords for you, uh, for the price of thirty gold. They are used, but all they need is a is a is a nice um pumice oh, stone, and, and they'll be clean. brand new. Th- thirty gold for the three. Yes, thirty for three. You get one free, basically. Well, if I would sell them new. But let's see, what do you say for twenty gold? Come on. Uh let's call it even at twenty five. Alright, alright, I'll fucking do it. Thanks, Yaj. Notice that accent's gone there again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so bad with I don't I, no more accents from Pond. 
<laughs> no, keep going, keep going. <laughs> I won't say anything else. No, I'm just, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> what else you, what else you got? You over there, what do you have your filthy paws on? Watching anything, because you haven't told me what I'm looking at. <laughs> So nice. over there, there are various maps. There's a few trinkets. Um, you notice that there's a staff, um, a bunch of scrolls, actually. Um, hmm? These are. I, don't, I want the good shit. The good shit's behind the counter. Fuck me. Well, and I'm just allowed to look around. Nobody's like... Well, when you keep shifting back and forth, you're kind of suspicious, but, you know. I didn't! I went from one side to the other! <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Uh, Nickel does come uh, towards the counter just to observe what is behind the counter there. Okay, well, I am stealing some trinkets while Dario is bothering to so get shit on. Uh, roll sleight of hand. <laughs> Can I uh, knock over something on the counter by accident while pointing? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> you can take. All right. So let me find my trinkets list here. You wanted potions, but like I'll take whatever shit. No, I potions are behind the counter, unfortunately. Yeah, However, okay. you're able to obscure cool uh, 23 trinkets. You're able to find a lock, actually. Um, an actual, a small drum. Oh. A extra pouch to carry things with. Fuck yeah. Um, and a... Two torches. Okay, I... Oh, and, and one scroll. It's a 23. Yeah. It's a 23. Yeah, you can have a scroll, yes. I'll give that to you. Um... <laughs> However, I can't wait to tell you what that scroll is. But later. okay, I'm excited. Yeah. It's I hope it's gay. <laughs> well, <laughs> that's pretty gay. Yeah. <laughs> and so she's way. completely distracted, and you know, looking yeah. at Dario, being like, and she's that's taking the weapons and oh, ugh, just grabbing them and kind of like putting them off to the side. Um, oh my gosh! Don't strain yourself. Oh, these old muscles are fine. Is that what you're calling him? And she just looks like mock offended for a moment and just goes, look, look at here, boy. Oh, shit. Yeah, fuck yeah, Yash. And she looks, a little, she gives a little laugh and says, do you, you got anything else you're looking for trading or selling or buying? No, I've got buying? something a little special. I'm going to buy, Yash. I'm going to buy. Just bear with me. I've got a whole sack of shit. Now, I've got 10 first edition books. I can't say how these came into my possession, oh my God. but they're, they're covering the, the history of a certain god, god, and there might be some very, very wealthy collectors interested in these books. And, and so, I just lay them out on the counter. All right. Uh, roll perception. Also, I forgot what you said I got. Um, can you tell me again what they were? <laughs> So you're just watching, you're kind of looking at the books in admiration of your, your catch there. Uh, so, Les, you were, uh, Reese was able to get a drum, mm -hmm. a lock, a mm -hmm. pouch, two torches, and a scroll. And a scroll. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. Because that pile of things was not enough. <laughs> why the fuck did you grab a torch? You're not going to get one. I, I wouldn't grab, I think I'm carrying, I don't need a torch, so I wouldn't All right, so bail on the torches. No, you should just get them and sell them to her. Sell them back to her. Two scrolls. Okay, fair enough. No, not two scrolls. You only get one. <laughs> yeah, but I'm subbing out the two torches. No, nope, that's not how that works. I think it is. And so Yaj <laughs> is looking at the counter here and inspecting all the books and she looks and kind of flips open the one of the covers, inspecting. She even takes one up. Careful, Yaj. They're very old. She sniffs very it. Old. And nope, I'm ignoring your sleight of hand roll. Um... <laughs> And she places it back on the table and she's like, I, I will say that these look like a mighty fine collection that I'd love to have, but uh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to sell these. They're, you know, it, it screams stolen all over it, and I know I can't ask questions. Yash, and... Yash, Yash, they're not stolen. 
We we listen. We're, we're low key. If you key. say the word liberated, I'm just no, no, no. We're low key heroes. We're we've actually been helping Olgma, and that's how we got the books. These were given to us in exchange for our services. I almost got my dick bitten off for it. I it do. I do believe that. I I do. I do. Look. Let let me tell you. For for the lot of books, I'll give you. Let's say fifty gold. No fucking way. Damn it. You fucking piece of shit. <laughs> you yuck. Fuck you. Hey, hey, okay, if you're going to use that type of language with me, you can get out of my shop. You can take your books okay, I, and I, go. I, wait, I, 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 shoved the, I shoved the bags, the books into my bag, and I wink at, at uh, Reese as I turn around. I just say, nice doing business with you, guys. And I sling it over my back and uh, start working, walking back towards Nickel. And, so and then you, as I sling it, I purposely knock something over. <laughs> you know the out. rule. You break it, you buy it. What's this Get thing here? Get back here. I want to steal what this is. I didn't fucking break it. It's a, it's a fucking stack of, of, of papers. Reese, you're supposed to be stealing. I did. I, I just rolled for it. <laughs> <laughs> so you're able to steal. Are you looking for what's on the counter right there? Yeah. Behind right. the counter. I can't get behind the counter. So you are able to hear that little item on the counter. You can add a. Let's see what it is. It has. It better be good because that's a twenty-four. It's a vibe check. Well, that just it tells how good you are at stealing it. It yeah, doesn't say what it is. Yeah, but uh, last time I rolled really well, you let me steal many great things. Yes, but you when you barter with it, see your what you're getting goes down. Okay, I apologize. Please give me something nice. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Uh, it's actually so you notice. Uh, you notice behind the behind that actual uh, jar there. There's actually a staff leaning up, and you're able to just like whoop, and grab it and walk off. Let's go. Okay, I gotta go. And uh, let me just roll. What a Something real quick. Oh my god, I'm gonna get caught. Equipment. Manage inventory. Nope, your wife does not notice. <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> well, despite right. her Hell watching yeah. you. So you're able to make your way out of the store. Fuck you, Yash. I yell as I fucking leave. And Off, Yash. Oh, fuck <laughs> you. You wrinkly fuck. <laughs> okay, what kind of Forgot stuff what, is it? what words we're allowed. There are options. <laughs> You're allowed all the words. Tell me, tell me what kind of stuff it is. So you will, to be able to properly investigate, you can do so out on the street if you want to risk being caught. However... Okay, no. I'll, I'll book it. We gotta go. I'll look at it later. You, I'll let you make the decision as to what it is. Yes. I already know what it is, Fuck but, you. however... Fuck you, Yaj. GG's. And so you all start making your way out of the city, unless there's anything else you need. Yeah, I gotta pick I up my I needed to go to... to I needed... The fucking guy... Um, hold on, I have it in my notes. I pick up my armor! Your okay, armor, right? Yeah. So you were able to on the way. The, the armor is actually like uh, Riker. Oh, Riker! You guys are actually looking out for Riker, and you don't see him out um, there. But uh, as as you start heading towards the area where Reese had dropped off the armor um, or the materials to make armor, mm -hmm. uh, you you actually are able to spot him from quite a distance. Um, and he has his little cart, uh, and is just looking happy as ever, talking with a random individual trying to, you know, sell a little trinket or so. Um, Can I shout out to him in Elvish and say, what up, my guy? And he looks up and he's like, oh, look at, look at, yeah, Dario. And he gives you a big wave from across the, across the street there. Um, Rika, do you want to join our party? We're gonna go, like, save the world and shit. Oh, oh no, I'm sorry. I'm not one for saving the world. Like, I, I appreciate people who do that. However, 
I know my skill set is just not, it's, I would be more of a hindrance. Fine, Yaj. Uh, have I got something for you? <laughs> I got ten first edition books that I need you to take off my hands. Oh, well, first edition of what, then? And he looks very Listen, these are These are extremely rare. Extremely rare. And I pull one book out and gently pass it over to him. This is from Ogma's tomb. How, how did you like this? Like, the Ogma. Dude, we're on a mission. I can almost lost my dick. It's a long, it's a long story. Wow, that is quite an. But we need, we need, we need lose. money to slay. You know the giant dragon in the sky. Like we're trying to kill it. We need some money to kill well, the fucking you, thing. You are. You're trying to take on that. Dra well, I'm very glad I said no to your proposition earlier because I could not. I, I mean, you all will do such a great job. I'm, I'm very sure of that. I'm very, yep, yep. And I cast like a perception or something. That yeah, go insight, ahead. Insight, whatever it is. Uh, insight, if you're, what are you trying to gather? I want to know if he's being an asshole, if he, or if he genuinely like believes in us. You're able to gather that he just genuinely is trying to be as polite as possible, and he has no real assessment of your skills. Hell yeah. Well, I'll take it. Thanks, thanks, Riker. We we hope to not die. Yeah, I would I would love it for you not to die mm. as well, as you know who's gonna sell you the best stuff. It's me. Oh, yeah, we know, we know. I mean, we, we came looking for you. So, so about my book now. Yeah, you both. What are we? What are we thinking? And he starts flipping through the pages and inspecting them. And so, you know what? You know what? this this is quite a collection. I feel like it belongs in a museum. Uh, I don't know. It's gonna be difficult well, to sell, but I mean, yeah? unfortunately, museums we don't think are open right now, Riker. And no, many of them are not. You are correct. We know you're the man to get into those deals. I mean, look at me. No one's gonna just slut a barbarian walk inside with a stack of first editions. You're the guy. You're the guy, Riker. Well, maybe if you put on a shirt. But yes, I understand what you're saying. Yes, yes, wow. yes. I physically cannot put on a shirt. Do you not see the size of my fucking muscles? I mean, they are very... Yes, yes, I do see them. Okay, okay, well, let me... Okay. Well, for the, the, the ten books you said you have. Ten here. Yes, ten books. I will give you 500 gold. Get shit on. Um, I look at, um, um, Reese. I'm or... looking at Nicole, because she knows more about that shit than I do. Nicole leans forward and says, I also think they should be in museum and we should give them to them for free. Okay, never mind. <laughs> uh, Riker, <laughs> is that the best you can do? 500. But... These books are very old. I think a museum would pay you handsomely. Well, like at least a honestly, thousand. museum usually takes donations, so it'll be I'll well, be at quite a bit of a well, loss. We have for to this, play a dragon. Believe, We're not. I know, and that's why I'm willing to give you such a. a, a... What are you gonna do with the books? Is the better question. Well, oh, what gonna am I gonna do? No, yeah. I have no intention of harming them. Well, I would like to first. I'd like to read them. This okay, is quite a fine. But what you, okay, but after that, what are you gonna do with them? After that, I will. I will actually. I'm sure I will take them to either a museum or a university. Or perhaps okay. Ogma's Temple. I feel like they would can love I, it. Okay, can I roll to ch scope that out? Yes, roll in uh, insight. Insight? Yep. Dario got a. I'm a fucking 15. gamer. You're rolling high. That means oh. you're going to roll low for your battle today. Fine. You um, think so? Fuck off, DM. <laughs> so, uh, is he being genuine? He is being genuine, but you do, so you're both able to find the fact that he's being very genuine, but you do see that he is very, very, very interested in reading them. No. I would sell them. Okay. Uh, yeah. Riker, could you do, could you do 600? 600. Oh, oof. Roll persuasion. Can I roll oh. persuasion? You're not part of the deal here. Yes. God damn it. Fuck me oh. in the ass. Like, I, I'm sorry, 500. Like, you know me, I'm an honest guy. I try to I try to give you deals where I can't remember all those deals I gave you before. Yeah? Okay, yeah. Riker, I can. I okay. can definitely. Okay, can middle, we say 550 middle, and I throw in a studded leather? I'm going to throw, throw in a studded leather thing with it. All right, I'll, Wait, I'll take that. Can I ask really quickly, just to remember, in this world, people don't know where. Do people know where the tomb is? Yes. Or is it just the other world that people didn't know? People knew where knew where the tomb was, but they also knew it's incredibly difficult to get to. Five fifty. 
Pot 50. Pot 50 plus the, and I'm plus like, the studded curling. leather. Yes. Yes, with the studded leather leather. Of course. I wouldn't shot you, Riker. You you're the best salesman in this town, even though you're mobile. Thank you, thank you. I will I think being on wheels is the best way to go. Do you know I... anyone who's interested in Minotaur bones or dragon pots of various length, <laughs> sizes, and sharpness? Uh well, unfortunate with the city getting, you know, in the state it is, I'm not sure I know anyone right now who's interested in those things, and unfortunately that's not usually the repertoire of what I sell. But, uh, you know, if I... You got a potion. Do I have a yeah, potion? Yeah, we need potions. We need well, fucking potions. I think, I think Yaj had the potions, Reese. <laughs> Shit. Yaj we didn't did even have the potions. We gotta go back to Yaj. <laughs> just, just for, we'll just go back real, real quickly. Okay, Riker, I'm I appreciate it. I'm selling 550 shit to you. Perfect. Go back to Yaj and tell her that you sold them for 550 and also tell her that you're stacked and we you want potions. all the potions. When you yeah. make right, your way it. back to Yaj's store, you no, notice it's it's to us. that it is actually closed. I know! The Come door on. is locked. I'm breaking in! I'm breaking in! I'm breaking in! I'm breaking in! How do I break I'm in? I'm the muscle. I'm the muscle. How do I break? What's the? What do I roll to break in? How are you trying to break in? There's lots of I ways. The, wait, let's scope it out. Let's I'm scope gonna, it out I'm first. Pick, I want to pick the lock. And as or you start to bend down to pick the lock, your wife stands over your shoulder and says, "Are you seriously trying to do this?" This we is... just have to have. We just have to have one conversation where we we have. A lot of gold now, and we need potions, babe. Why are you making it weird? Hey, You're can I making just it weird. Manhandle the door, like while Check they're arguing. Windows. Roll Check the windows. Roll a uh, just a straight up strength check, which is like so where your plus three but is. Six, motherfucker. <laughs> All right. So you're able to as they're arguing, and as Nickel says, this is clearly wrong. You've already pissed her off or angered her. Uh, Dario just boom, just breaks through the deadbolt there that was barely hanging on to her store that is already in shambles. As soon as I fall in, I say, oh my god, I slipped. And just in case. I didn't even realize the door was locked. We're so sorry. I tripped. You of all, all this rubble. You all stumbled <laughs> in. And you see Yaj actually on the other side, and Dario's right here. And uh, you're actually looking up at, uh, at Yaj. From like the, she's about three foot six, and she has her arms on her hips, and she says, "Well, what are you doing here?" Yash, love, I'm so sorry. Uh, we yeah, need potions. We apologize. I slipped. I, I tried to knock on your door, and my I muscles are just so that. big. I fell. I can fix that for you right now. I'll. I can fix that. Like, I'll. I'll re. Can you fix I'll, my door? Because someone better pay for yeah. it. I'll reattach the lock right now. I'm very We're so skilled. sorry. So right. sorry, Yash. So how are you going to reattach the lock? Oh, with my tools. <laughs> what tools do you have? Uh, some might think they're for picking locks, but actually they are fixing in fact locks. for fixing locks. <laughs> do you have I'm a lesbian, a... that's how Wait, we hold roll. on. Do you have a... You do not have a uh, inventory. Yeah, I don't have an inventory. No, I'm hold on. Let me let me read your inventory. You do not have a lock picking set. Oh, do I need one? Yes, you do. Uh, so That's, if you were to try and pick, you a let lock, me pick locks all the time. Okay, well then I'll. No, fix you it with have my opened hand. locks with your mage, mage hand. hand. That's yeah, right. It's different. <laughs> we'll fix it with your mage hand. Yeah, I'll fix it so, with my mage hand. Do you have like a screwdriver or something? I'll fix it right up for you. And she hands you a tool bucket, which she was already holding because she was trying to She's do some She's a lesbian. Repairs. She already has a tool bucket. <laughs> like, and it's also going to be 10 gold for the door. The fuck well, I'm not going to fix, fix it. it. <laughs> Get shit on. Like, uh... That's fine. I'm a, you oh, know, no, I'm not... Reese, Reese, we need the potions. We need okay, the potions. Just, I'll, I'll give the gold. I'm, I'm working on the lock. Now, let's let's work the, the, the 10 gold into the price of the potions we need, Yaj. Oh, you need some potions, do you? Yes, that's what we were here for. I told you I was knocking on the door. Yaj, as she's saying, you need potions, looks over towards Reese. Mm. God damn it, Reese. Who has stepped into the building and trying to fix the door. Yeah. And she's like, what's that you got there? What do you mean? That this, is, staff. Uh, this is your tool bucket. <laughs> that yeah, staff strapped magic. to your have back? 
And I show off the my The one that hand. was like, missing right back here. Nothing missing. I don't know what you're talking about. She sees it. She rolled a natural 20. Oh, really? Okay. That's fine. And she says, she leaps forward and. We get in a fight. Roll Gary, initiative? Not rolling initiative. <laughs> <laughs> twice in a row what the fuck i'm gonna oh no she grabs the staff out of your uh from where you're holding it because you yep. don't have a way to store it and shoves you both out of the store and slams the door shut wait doesn't what would she roll she rolled a natural 20 in what? Does she though? move an immovable like I'm a fucking man? You're not yeah. gonna tell me. Yeah. Yes. She She's rolled in. In yeah, she like rolled in athletics. Foot. Does he not get to roll against that? Or uh, Dario, Dario roll. You pain. need to get a higher than a natural twenty. Come on, Dario. Well, I just need you to get a... higher than twenty, right? Reese is out, doing? and Nicholas. Athletics? athletics. Roll a straight up strength check. You're not rolling athletics. You're rolling against strength, which is your plus three. Uh, no, sorry, oh, your strength is on the top. Wait, so close. Did I do the wrong one? It's all right. This, it's all right. We're taking that. And so you are both forced no, no, out of the door. No, no, we're taking this one. No, you're not. That's not even the right check still. I said a strength <laughs> check, which is on the <laughs> top left. Wait, where? Oh, this so strength. Thing. So strength is like if you see like your okay. regular. Yeah, that's like your regular <laughs> check. Like the top top. I was looking yeah. at like strength saving. Okay. No, no, it's okay. Um. And so you are all forced out and the door slams shut and she says, if you come within a hundred yards of my shop again, I will call the gods on you. I mean, the door's not anything. locked. You don't have a lock, so like... <laughs> we should beat her ass. I whisper. I whisper. You know what? Nickel's here. <laughs> you look like you're like... Ugh. Nickel starts walking off and she says, you know what? We're not doing this. We're not doing this. I do not want to try and save the world with you idiots. And she looks directly at Reese when she says that and starts storming off. She we, we, we were joking. We were I joking. I don't know what it was. Let's go, Reese. I, I, I grab yeah, Reese by the, by the arm and tug her along I really wanted bit. that. I'm, I'm, no, I'm you got so her tools. You got her tools. Let's fucking go. Oh, that's right. I do. Yeah, get shit on <laughs> Fuck you do have a small yosh. toolbox if you want to carry. Hell yeah. Fuck, Fuck you, yeah, I, do. I need this. this is... <laughs> I would just grab one of the tools and I'd throw it through the window as I'm leaving. <laughs> Roll. Uh, so you're, you want to throw it through the window? Yeah, it's going to be a cunt. After she throws it, I grab her other arm. And I'm now <laughs> grabbing Reese by both arms. Please roll a off. hit with your like with your dagger. Where the fuck's that? She didn't throw it at Josh, did she? Yeah, she's but she's rolling for the window. She's aiming. Oh, okay. Like this? Mm-hmm. Twelve. So you're able to it shatters through the window and you just hear it you <laughs> yell. Get shit on! <laughs> for once I'm like, we gotta go, we gotta go. Just tugging um, her along. So as you Nick all is carrying me. You all are t following Nickel, who is heading I'm straight so back home. I'm just uh, going to sling Reese's tiny angry. ass over my shoulder. That's fine. You can take me. Carry their find bucket. <laughs> Nickel, uh, so making your way back home takes quite a bit. Are you going to try and stop her? or Someone has to. <laughs> Nickel, Nickel, we were joking. We were fucking joking. Let's come on. We gotta and go. She, we gotta uh, go. Everyone hydrate. I I just did. I can't. I don't have anything. Yeah. Well, I hydrated, Lunar. And she whirls her head around. And she says, "No, I'm not doing this. Uh, I had what I thought was an impression of how this was going to go, and you both have immediately showed me that." You're not taking this seriously, and actually, you are worse for the world than the dragon. Hey, well, that is absolute fucking garbage, and I'm yelling from Dario's shoulder. I'm not even looking because I'm assuming that I'm looking like I'm assuming that I'm thrown over his shoulder, and I'm just yelling at nothing. Um, we're just trying to get <laughs> potions so that we don't die. <laughs> You just and broke down her door, threw a no, tool through no, her window. No, 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 that's not what happened. <laughs> fuck Yaj, first of all. Nickel, now look, 
I know we have our faults, but we've slayed wyverns, mimics, minotaurs, like all the fucking things, okay? We're gonna kill this fucking dragon. Or we might get into some shit along the way, but at the end of the day, we're gonna make the world safer for all of our kids. For the children. And she does we stop are the it. World. <laughs> she does stop in her stride when you say that. Um but then uh and turns and says Fine, I'm going, but I have no intention of talking to either of you for the duration of at least the day. Can we, can we just pause? Is this like the first time Dario's convinced anybody of anything? I think so. Good job. <laughs> Dario out here oh, saving yeah, Dario my marriage. Like, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. You can't just That's not all. talk to me. And she is ignoring oh, you as she oh, is turning it, in her path. Gone. To continue right. on. Take me to the armory, Dario. We're not talking to this bitch. We gotta All go. Right. I, I put I put Reese down, but oh, you... I'm I'm gonna hold on to, to her arm for just a little longer. Okay. <laughs> she looks a little angry. Not wrong. Are we holding hands? You no, are we're not able... holding hands. I'm holding okay. by the wrist. Just checking. You this are able okay. to swing by the armory <laughs> to grab the uh, special armor that was made. Um Do they have potions? They do not have potions there in Armory. I'm going to ask him if he knows someone who has potions that's not that bitch yard. And then you got some potions? I <laughs> get some potions. So. So, sorry, sir. I I just do armor. Um, <clears throat> I'm who are sure you calling a fucking to... sir? She was talking to you first. <laughs> You're not going to just disrespect my friend like that. <laughs> Your mom? Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. Um, but if you go down to the market, the, I, I don't really know. But you are this able to gather with the amount of shops that are closed down currently and the disrespect that you did cause on an influential market person that you will have a oh, very bullshit. hard time finding potions. Come on. We'll just send well, how about we'll just send um Nickel because she didn't. She's unwilling to do it. She doesn't want to get potions at all. Nickel? No. Nickel. We need we need no potions. Way. You're both she fucking wants, glass cannons. I, see, you would rather I die. Then you just go swallow your pride and get some potions. Dead ass. She says, I will not let you die. I am not a glass cannon. I'll and... give you some money, Nicole. <laughs> Babe. Well, uh, so, Reese, roll persuasion with advantage because you have Dario helping you here. X isn't with us anymore. Bless her heart. We. We need some extra. Let's go. I don't know what it is. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> so she looks just so irritated and she. And has... I look really sad. She looks at Dari and says, I do not need your gold, but thank you. And... Wait, I want you to give this to, to Yash, though. 25 gold. And she does take it. The dock. 25 gold, please. Uh -huh. And she says, I'll be back. And uh, it takes only about like ten minutes or so for her to come and back. In that time, I want who's selling alcohol. Oh no! <laughs> there are a few uh, taverns that are open, indeed. Yes. Um, Ninety-nine bottles of meat on the wall. Let's do what it. What do you think? If you'd Let's like to it. go. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah! So in that ten what minutes, to say? you are you you guys go in and you ask for a drink. Yeah, yeah, but I just want to. I want. I want to take it home. I want to take it with me. I don't want to stay. I'm not that dumb. Oh, so are you asking for like a bottle? Yeah. All right. So please, uh, a bottle would be three dollars, ma'am. Uh, three gold. gold. Three gold. What? <laughs> yeah, I'll take it. Uh, can oh I? God. Can I get you anything, sir? Oh yeah, I'll take a, a glass of mead. He's like perfect. Uh, that'll be. Um, Oh. You, you got me right, Reese. Yes, fine, sure. Wonderful. Uh, so also <laughs> remove five silver from your inventory. Okay. I just chug it quickly. Perfect. Um, you glance out the window to see Nickel looking around where she left you all and just looking so angry. Okay, we're going back. <laughs> we'll come back out. Uh, I'll follow. Did you try to hide the bottle of... It's in my bag. Okay, just, you never specified that, so. Sorry, my bad. It's in my bag. I didn't drink any of it. I just brought it with me. Wonderful. 
And she sees you both come out of a tavern and just rolls her eyes and says, Are we ready? <laughs> yes. Yes, did we are. Did she, did, do, who's carrying? Do I have the armor? Yes. Because you I'm picked it up. giving that to her because it's right. not for me. Perfect. I will add it to so her. I, I already I, added it to her inventory, so. What is it? It is a studded leather armor with a extra um, bonus against fire. Okay. And I say, babe, I got this for you. Oh, can, I, can you stop being mad at me now, please? And she looks at you, and you, you can tell she just wants to yell at you right now, and snatches it and walks away. <laughs> but you are able to make your way out of the city and okay. well while we're walking yes what happens if i put a hand on her i need to know what hand are you putting where uh i'll make it pg i i'm just like <laughs> I, I i'm just <laughs> just put like a hand on her arm and i'm just testing like the waters to see how far i can do that so you're able to put a hand on her arm and she doesn't argue mm -hmm. with you about it okay well then uh, then then i wanna like um, we're gonna hold hands nothing like super gay just like vibing. putting hands is super gay yeah but like it's not like sexual right she she <laughs> will let you take her hand and she will not like uh Bite you on that, but she does not talk oh, yeah. for the, the journey okay. remaining. Okay. I'm just gonna give it like a little squeeze, and that's it. Is there anything that she knows what she was in for? She knew what she married. She knows what's going on. Uh, <laughs> is there anything that Reese and Dario talked about since Nickel is remaining mostly quiet for the duration of this? I'm talking about my hatred of Yaj. <laughs> that Yaj, she's a real cunt, isn't she? I'm telling Dar like I like look, what's I'm the fucking deal? I she I happen <laughs> God here we go. I <laughs> happened to find this scroll when I was in there. Um <laughs> interestingly enough. <laughs> scroll. Is it <laughs> yeah, like a letter know. or I don't know. What's and I'm gonna hand it to Dario. Cause my hand is busy. All right, I want to read the scroll. What's right. your hand busy with? She's holding Nickel's hands. Nickel. That's right. I forgot Nickel was there, honestly. He's been so <laughs> quiet. She has been very, very quiet. Um, and you see that this is a scroll of shocking... No, sorry. A scroll of vicious mockery. Hell yeah. Um, Mood. Is it so, like is it like your bummer jokes? What's that do? It's essentially so <laughs> it would take you a little bit more time to really figure out how to use it, but what a scroll is is basically it, you use it in place of a spell. Like you and it okay. will burn away. Um you unleash a string of insults laced with subtle enchantments at a creature you can see within range. If the target can hear you, though it need not understand you, it must succeed a wisdom saving throw or take 1d4 psychic damage and have disadvantage on the next attack roll it before the end of its turn. Shit on. Uh, and the spell's damage increases by 1d4 when you reach 5th level. So I say all this to Reese and I say, do you want, who do you want to use this? Well, can anyone use it? Uh, technically, anyone can use it, but the person with the highest, uh, so it, um, like a magic user is most likely for it to succeed because it's a wisdom okay. based save. So it's based off Reese, of the wisdom. Uh, Reese, you've got like a very sharp tongue. I think you should hold on to this. Okay. Hell yeah. Yeah, because there's like Yaj insults with like peak. Peak asshole. <laughs> so here you go. Pass Can't she stole. Up. Can't believe she stole my fucking. What was it? Your my staff. Own. Like you own yeah, that fan bit. square. Like the fuck. Yeah. The fuck. Honestly, though, like anybody could have had a staff like that. Yeah, that's like fair. she didn't even ask she, you for she, a fucking know, receipt. She just assumed. She, yeah, I don't know how she knew that. Because we should go back there and get one. your staff back. <laughs> and uh, Nicole just raises a brow and continues walking at a faster pace. 
Coco, maybe we should drop the gosh. Drop the gosh. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll deal with it later. <laughs> but you are able to travel throughout the evening um, and like find a comfortable place that is at the base of the mountains to camp for the evening. Um, and as you are um, at, at the base of the mountains, like leading into the forest where... Um. Wow. Get everyone in. There. That's nice. Is that a squirrel? Uh, it's a backpack. Oh, never mind. I like how you knew what I was talking about. Yeah, I was like, "What squirrel looking here?" <laughs> uh, and there's Dario. Yep. Yeah. She really not going to talk to me at all. <laughs> uh, so she is uh making the the mats currently for sleeping on. Um, do you try to approach her? Yeah. All right. What do you do? What's Dario doing first? I want to know. I think mean, we're best friends now, so. Uh, do you really want to know, Reese? Do I know? Oh my god! Like I'm fucking... I don't want to know. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> I'm I'm taking the time to just quickly rub one out. It's been a stressful day. <laughs> just gonna do that. Get that over with. I'm sorry. We we're gonna. South I, I, I'm gonna tell her we need to go. No, 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 no. don't no, worry. We, we, we walk away. I'm we like, I'm like a ma- Well, yeah, I'm like a master. I'm in my in my bed, bro, doing it. Like you can hardly tell. It just looks like I'm whittling a stick under the covers. I feel like I can tell. And I'm looking around, uh, just to you know, I want to make sure we're safe because we've had bad experiences in the wood. I feel like I feel like we can tell something's happening. Um, Dario, please roll, roll sleight of hand. <laughs> <laughs> literally oh no <laughs> okay I didn't even say <laughs> uh, Reese roll perception okay there's no way I have natural to one I natural have a, one I have, plus, I have a plus five to perception you won't oh my that. god <laughs> and so wait uh, make nickel roll re-roll no, oh we'll- Dr. Phantasmal. So I should clarify because you both rolled at the same time and I'm not sure which one he wanted because of the delay. Dr. Phantasmal, what's up? Also, hi, Miss Henry Porter. Uh, who did you want to re-roll for that? Was it Definitely Dario's reads. stealth in that? Oh, the perception check. Perfect. Please re-roll your perception check. Mine. Like yes. I said, there's no point. I have a plus five. If you so get if a one, one, roll. Like... Oh, oh my like, god! Well, it's a six. It's a six the... versus six. Like, yeah. Oh, so we roll again, or? Welp. Here, well, because it's a plus five, I'll let Dario re-roll the sleight of hand just for the. For Fuck. The funsies. Natural twenty. That is, please. That I doesn't make any sense. 18. No. I okay, won. so it failed anyway. I'm just checking. I'm, We're I'm here for the away. humor. Fuck you, Yaj. Uh, so <laughs> you are. Where are you leading, <laughs> Nickel? Then. Like, just away. Away. <laughs> Perfect. I was creating an opportunity for you guys to be that, able to have some time fine. together. And I'm like, you don't want to see what's going on there. We need to go. Just trust me on this. And she looks distressed but follows regardless. Because she knows I'm right. Says, I... Yeah. What, what were you doing back there? That is completely rude and... At disregard for the law or anything like mm. what? Can I what? hear this? Um, no, you're busy. <laughs> but I no, but I do have like very good hearing. Yeah, roll perception. I will say if your hand is still on your junk, roll with a disadvantage. Well, it depends on if I hear it or not. Wait, it depends on if you hear it or not. If you're yes. oh, if you're continuing, I understand. Yes. Because uh, I'm like, is this bitch really still talking about Yaj and I lose my boner just like picturing. Actually, Yaj was hot. My... Never mind. Yeah, I'm pretty harder happy. and ready to go than ever. All right. So you are able to. Uh, they are pretty far away because it's. So you're, even with that high roll, it is pretty difficult to make out exactly what they're saying, but you can hear that they're very. They're talking, and you can at least hear the disappointment in Nichols' tone. And I assume that they're talking about Yaj. Yeah, you can probably assume it's about Okay, what okay. Been so let me just tell me what Daria is doing and we can go. So I'm just like grunting under my breath. I'm like, fuck Yaj. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, Yaj. Oh. 
End scene. <laughs> and that's what Daria is doing, everybody. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm glad that we know that. <laughs> yep. It's very important. Yeah. Uh, very important. So Nicole goes on to say, I just... Why, why did you think that was acceptable? That is completely just absurd. That's... Why would you do that? Well, we've met, though, right? Like... <laughs> That's, yes, and I you know. thought that stealing and trying to literally throw a wrench through someone's I'm window? Trying, I did it. I'm going to patrol. I'm here. under I would... a lot of stress, and it's just a lot for me. We've talked about this already, like, you know, I'm just going off the handles. Clearly. And I'm gravely disappointed, honestly. Okay, well, that's par for the course, so I'm not, like, surprised. She um, looks as if she's going to start walking away again from you. Okay, well, I, I want to be like, I need to give you something. What? <laughs> Fuck me. I'm going to take the bottle out of my bag and I'm going to give it to her. And it's still, it's not opened. It's still sealed, but I'm just going to like, I'm not going to say anything. I'm just going to hand it off. Is this what you're doing in that tavern? Yes. And you see her pull out a small dagger from her side Fuck. and pop yeah, okay. the cork of the bottle and she takes a swig from it. Yeah. From the straight from the bottle. And she says, Is it safe to go back now? I just need you to understand that, like, I'm trying to be better. But I'm going to make a lot of mistakes in that attempt. And I just need you to, like, be helpful, not hurtful. I'm happy, and you know that I want to help you, but the behavior you are displaying is far different than a mistake. I know you, and I've known you for almost 200 years now, and I've never known you to have such ill will against a person, to want to cause them harm in a way, and by, hurt, by breaking her shop, of a window when it's already in such destruction is causing her harm. I've never known you to be like that. I can be no. understanding. But just consider your, your actions. You don't even seem remorseful of it. You were just about to say she deserved it or something like that. I saw it well, on your wasn't. face. I heard it in the way you said, well. I promised you I wasn't going to say that. All right, then. I... I'm here for you. I'm here to help you. But if you're going to cause destruction like that, I don't know what I can do. You will cause that pain upon yourself in the end. Okay, well, you, what I was going to say is that you know that I am lacking like the usual guidance that I use to deal with most things anyway and i know that it's not your fault and i'm not blaming you or anything but like walking away like that just set me off and it felt really weird that dario of all people was the person to like help me and not you well maybe that's why natalie chose him for for him to be here okay cool bye and then i walk away <laughs> you walk away where do you go <laughs> i'm going back to i'm uh, like i'm assuming dario's like I'm assuming the sounds have died down and I can. In the Actually, distance, I'm not you going hear. to bed. Oh, yes! <laughs> I'm not going to bed. I am going to just sit here. Sit there. Wonderful. Yep. She does go back to bed and That's she, fine. she, she gets under the cot and pulls mm. the blankets up. Yep. Um, and so, does that mean Reese is taking first watch? Yeah. Wonderful. 
We're going to take a quick BRB and refresh our stuff. And soon we'll be introducing Lunar. So I'm so sorry that Spoilers. it's been an hour and a half. <laughs> sorry. Well, I just wanted to prepare her. So we'll be back soon. Be back in like, you know, the usual five to seven minutes. Chaos and destruction in their hometown of Moltra and is now on Moltra. the is now on the way to Lake Vride. Call it that. Um, it is their first night out, and Dario had a little thank you for the welcome back shadow. Uh, Dario had a little relief uh, as he started settling for the evening, and uh, Nickel and Reese had a disruption. However, um, night is starting to fall. So, Reese, are you planning to take first watch if that is if you're sulking by the trees? I'm not sulking. Oh, she sorry. had a go at me, and she knows what she said. And she knows that she was being rude, and I have chosen to remove myself from the situation so that it doesn't get any worse. I'm and pretty sure that's the definition and, of sulking. And and if she doesn't want to have a conversation with me about that, that's cool. I'll just vibe out here. I love sleeping in the grass, and I'm good for it. You are. So are you taking first watch? Yes, I'm vibing. Okay. But everybody else can leave me alone. Wonderful. Please uh, roll perception. Hit me. Sorry, I was just out in session. Here. Me? Oh, sorry. All I'm my checks sleep, are right? just showing up somewhere. Like, my for this tab, all my checks are showing up. So I thought you rolled a nature check just for fun, but they're all just popping. <laughs> oh, it's just no, vibing. I was like, what? She's just, just checking vibing. it out. I got okay. 17. Got 17. Perfect. So you're actually mm -hmm. able to hear a little rustling in the distance. Um, I'm not doing that anymore. <laughs> and it's not Dario by surprise. Oh. Where is it coming from? Uh, so it's coming from, uh, if I were to, right here. Yeah, if you just ping it for me. Yeah. Wait, I can't so right see here. It. Where is it? You can't no, see the ping. It. It's in a bush. Is it up here? Is it up here? There's, <laughs> You're there, just gonna go right to there's it. There's a spot there. Oh wait, hold on. I think it's because don't I'm wake here. us up, Greece. So there's. I'm just trying to okay, find. Okay, you can see oh, it now. Right, so it's here, right in front of me. That's where I'm standing. Right, yeah. and also here, and also oh, over here. Me. So you're starting to hear multiple noises all around. Can I tell what it is? Roll a nature check. Oh my god! Wait, where where is that? Oh, get shit on! Just wait till you're fighting. You can tell. I was about to say, yeah. You hear this, <laughs> and it sounds like boars, wild boars. Okay, I'm, I'm, get, I'm waking everybody up. You're waking everyone up. All right. Yeah. Just as you start to head this way, you see an actual wild boar start charging your way here. Where am I looking? Okay. Here. And then another one is trying to charge in towards the the party. This side here. And then suddenly, as you make your way to about here to start waking everybody okay. up, you're shouting. I'm screaming. You're screaming. You actually see yeah. come from the the shadows, not just a regular boar, but one that has a human-like shape to it. That, uh. Uh, and he's holding... Um, Kanosuke? <laughs> Hello? Hello? Wow! Um, he's holding a maul and just looking very. I don't know what that is. At you. It's like a big stick. Okay. I would like to be sense man, man boar. Can speak with sense? animals. I mean, speak with animals. Uh, so he, when you try to speak with him. He is uh, unable to, uh, because he is a humanoid, he's not considered an animal. Can I do it to one of the animals? You can do it to one of the boars if you'd like to try and talk. Yes, I would like to tell them we have food. Don't hurt us. All right. Roll persuasion. Please, God, okay. this is the only role I'd care about. 17. That's not bad. And you see one of the, the this boar here, the, the purple boar, look kind of curious at you and pause. Says, food, what food you got? 
All right, I want to go up to him with uh, some of my rations and use beast sense. All right. Beast sense. Oh, fuck! That guy down there! <laughs> They're just popping up all over. Uh, okay, hold on, let I me look at your beast out. sense. I gotta go. Do you want me to read it? You can touch a willing beast for the duration of the spell. You can use your action to see through the beast's eyes and hear what it hears. Continue to do so until you use your action to... Okay. While perceiving through the beast's senses, you gain benefits of any special senses provided by that possessed by that creature. You're blinded and deafened to your own surroundings. All right, now that I have merged my soul with purple purple boar, purple boar, I want to communicate with the leader, green boar man. Uh, so what are you trying to communicate? I want to say Anasuke, we're 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 nice people. We don't want to hurt you. We can share our rations with you and you can camp with us. 420, like, let's live it up, bro. And he just... <laughs> you think that I'm worried about you hurting us. And everyone roll initiative. That's, like I, that's not what I said! What the fuck? I said we were gonna share food! No, but you had said, we're not here to hurt you. Type of thing. So roll initiative. Nobody needs to get hurt! <laughs> Reese rolled an 11. I gotta roll for Bitch! People. Let's go! Big D! Core 20. 20 for Big D. Oof. That is a 12 <laughs> for Nickel. Um, oh, gosh. <laughs> Lunar, the cry. could you roll for your character? What no spoiler. Fuck? I need to know the order of things for when it happens, and it won't let me edit it after. That's my issue with it. Thank you. Great. Okay. <laughs> Get on. This is very fitting. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> shit on. in Telland for sure. <laughs> I love that it's just quiet on that end though. All right, there, perfect. All right, so at the top, that actually, as uh, Dario, your turn is actually skipped because you are. Well, you can. What do you want to do with the boar? I guess is the question. Uh, uh I want to go talk to his other boar pal, Yellow Boar. Measure beyond this cool thing that I can do. So that is actually beyond his uh, range or movement. Okay. Oh, okay. Wait, but the, he can't get within range just to talk to his boyfriend. Uh, well, he can like so like, they just can to grunt at him. Yeah. Okay. You, if you want to just grunt, that's all right. Yeah. Like, I want we want to talk or just tell him like, hey, these guys are are chill. Don't follow the other the the humanoids. Uh, let me just continue. You can use your action to see through the beast's eyes and hear what it hears. So you cannot actually communicate um, fully with that. The first creature was able to tell because he is a different type of being. But this one, uh, so your spell, you're able to hear what it hears and see through its eyes, but you can't control it. Okay. Can I talk to him that more? Yeah, you can. You know what? I'll just I'll use it to scope out the battlefield, and then I'm just gonna chunk it a, a hand axe at green guy. Okay, so roll for your hit. And I have two hand axes. Oh my god! <laughs> All right, so seven does not hit, unfortunately. Okay, here's the second one. <laughs> yep, go for it. Eleven also oh my. does not. Oh, wait, actually, yeah, 11 does hit. Yay! So roll for your damage. No! Four points Dude, of damage. Dude, she was, she was right. She fucking jinxed us, telling us that, like, our rolls are going to suck during the fights. And it's not jinx, it's actually just probability. So you could probably suck mine. Oh. Wow. <laughs> what the fuck, dog? Um, so that brings us to an end to your turn there. And brings us to giant boar A is uh this one right here. And using the Oh, we can totally get to read. Oh no. Um, so he's just gonna scoot on up over here. Rah, rah, rah. And he's going to not move twenty feet in a straight line because of the trees. So he is going to use a tusk attack. Towards Reese. And that is a 
21 to hit. That does hit. Hold on. Read something real quick. Um, where is it? Sorry, I'm also learning uh, Nichols stuff as well. Um, okay, so you're able to take half damage for whatever this damage is because she jumps in and absorbs half the hit for you. Um, you can jump that far? Holy fuck, I missed. Yeah, it's actually like a... I need to read it again. Oh, it's actually... No, you're good. So it's five points there. Um, it was a little difficult to read, my bad, sorry. No, you're good. Um, yeah. Is that like dog? Uh, when a creature you can see hits a target other than you with an Five feet of you. Okay, so actually you have to take full damage there. So it's five points of damage. That's okay. I can I use a reaction spell? Yes, you can. Um, so I have a reaction spell called Shield, and it um so I still get attacked, but it says until the start of your next turn you have plus five bonus to AC. Um, including against oh, including against the triggering attack. Plus five would put you at twenty one, so it does 21. not hit. Yeah. So you yeah. you that attack misses. That is correct. Get shit on! Hell yeah. So you're good for that. <laughs> and that um, means my armor class is 21 until... Until your next turn. My next That's turn. That's a good-ass spell. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So that brings us over to uh, this. Oh. And you hear just rudging through the um, oh God. ground there. Another one of these humanoid boar-like creatures. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh my god. Just start oh, yeah. stomping on through. This is what you asked for, remember? This is what you, you were. This is what you asked. I'm ready. I'm oh, ready to read. Uh, so he actually makes it all the way to here uh, before that's the end of his turn. And that brings us to the next one, who is this guy right here. And starts charging towards uh, Nickel in the back. And that's the end of his turn, Giant Boar. This one, who is right uh, next to Dario here, is actually going to make an attack because he's no longer under that influence and he sees his friends attacking. Very basic free creature here. And is going to make an attempt to use its tusk against Dario. Oof. We are friends. Uh, so that's a 13 to hit, so I don't believe that hits. Nope. Nope. 15, big boy. And this Hell boar just yeah. starts coming at you, and you take it by the tusks and just, like, toss it away with Holy that. Holy shit. Does All he right. take damage? Because a toss. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> the toss is very cinematic. But it is uh, Nickel's turn, and she is immediately up on her feet and leaps over this little fire here and up over t between uh, trying to get as best between uh, the enemies and Reese as possible. And immediately goes after this boar right here to try and hit with, uh, she's going to use her great axe here. Holy shit, here we go. And uh, does not hit. Wait, actually it might hit still. Plus seven. No. The boar. I think the boar is 12. Uh, yep, so it does not hit as she just swings this axe out. And it just goes uh, high over it. Uh, but misses Reese as well. Um, and she's actually going to then... She gets to attack twice, right? Because of the fighter class? She does get to attack twice. So she's going to take another swing right at it. And is just pissed off. And it does hit for this one. It took all the good rolls. <laughs> yep. So that's an 18 to hit there. Holy and fuck. she's going to cause... Uh, eight points of damage. That's not too bad. Let's, Let's go. Let's do that boar. Which boar? Yellow boar. Yellow boar. This one here. Eight points of damage. And that is the end of her turn there. 
And that brings us over to Reese. I'm ready to fight some hoes. Um, I am going to also attack the one that is directly in front of me, because I feel like that makes the most sense. Right. Um, and I would like to cast Witch Bolt. Okay. Fuck someone up. Yeah, go for um, it. 14. 14 does hit. And... Oh my god, it's fucking spinning, dog. Oh, it always... <laughs> 11 points of damage on that. Nice. He's out of there. He's not out of there. What the fuck? These are some strong ass. How's four. he looking? How's he looking? He's he's starting to look a little rough. He's oh, shit. Blood is starting to trickle out from his snout as he mm. grinds down on the ground there and just scrapes his hoof. What does he sound like? <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. I don't know. I didn't hear that. <laughs> Like, is he making <laughs> snorting sounds? Oh, no! That was oh, good. Oh, shit. There you go. It just took a minute, you know? Uh, and speaking of those sounds, this uh, this guy here is going to scoot on forward towards Dario. And <gasps> No. Not my new bestie. Uh, Fifteen. So he's going to and line himself up. Oh, he can get just under this tree, and he's going to do a charge attack on Dario. Here. Oh. Ouch. Um, oh. What you mean? So please, uh... And, if it, and then if it hits with its tusk on the same turn, the, uh, you take an extra amount of damage. So then he's going to try and hit you with his tusks. Oh, come on. That does not hit. So he starts charging at you, and you just kind of whoosh, right out of the way. There. Try again next time, kid. He will. That brings us... Uh, so then you all actually start hearing this, like, kind of uh, quiet rustling on the southern side of things as someone steps in quietly into play. And you see... A, uh, well, you, actually, you guys are mid-battle. What do they see, Lunar? Well, they see a pretty tall... Oh, God, not again. <laughs> Furbolgs are <laughs> seven foot minimum. And oh, what the fuck? <laughs> you should have been very tall. Okay, so you see a very <laughs> tall creature coming out from the shadows, approaching carefully to kind of join in and um they have long wavy red hair and she kind you can kind of tell with the, the eyes are very glowy in the dark because of the color because they're yellow so it's kind of like a night you know like cats sort of not cat eyes though just making that clear um and yeah nice. very despite the height not very big like Pretty, uh, slim. like a scrawny little fucker. No, no, just lanky. Lanky, that's a good Liz. way to put it. Um, <laughs> well, well, I'm five two, I'm not lanky. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, petite, petite, and, and uh, wow. just kind of wild looking a little bit because they are covered in um, leaves and branches and stuff. Oh, god, wearing. so yeah, is that fucking bush moving? <laughs> that's pretty much how it how it looks <laughs> that's how it sounds that tall no, 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 ass no, no, fucking no. It's, tree it's definitely okay so the, the the wear is more uh custom made from nature okay wow so that's okay. kind of what you're seeing perfect is that a custom made bush moving <laughs> hey, <you're in> combat. <laughs> so what are you so what are you doing uh our dearest well i'm gonna sneak up on the blue guy right here all right I'm not going to say anything to the group just yet. I'm just, you know, keeping a low profile, trying mm -hmm. to get an upper hand. And um, I'm a... Oh, God, I'm not X. Let me just figure this out. You want to back up, uh, people. I... <laughs> we'll put you back where you are. <laughs> no, no. How close? 10 feet. Okay, so back me up a little bit. I'm going to do a poison spray on this guy. All right. Wonderful. As a little surprise, you know? Because have they noticed me? They have not noticed you. 
So um, does that give me an upper hand or? Permits to exceed a constitution saving throw and take 1d12 poison damage. Uh, so I will say the concentration uh, saving throw is at a disadvantage because you are sneaking. Um, oh, so if I'm not sneaking, then I'll just go in. No, I'll no, see. I'm saying the constitution saving throw that the enemy has to make. Okay. Is that a disadvantage? Better We're doing that. <laughs> All right, I'm going to do that. I'm going to poison him. Oh, one of them's a 20. Fucking A. Uh, so, uh, six. So it fails that. And it takes uh, 18 points of damage right there. Damn. A little cantrip. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. I'm going to trip go. that bitch. So that was, uh, which one was that? So you have to move me so I was within 10 feet from him, yeah. at least. That's fine. Yeah. Docking the damage here. So, <laughs> you there. All right. So uh, you, you all hear that one of the uh, boar men, like, yell out in distress as it's, like, clawing at its own eyes, trying to, like, kind of get this poison off of its uh, But now it's Dario's turn. Uh, I'm going to move uh, here. Great. Um, is there? Can I like shout something to make them all like try to swarm me or something? You can try and get their attention. Uh, as you move, though, uh, both of these creatures get an opportunity of attack. Uh, so let me just Ooh. here. Uh, so the uh, the. Giant boar, just the regular boar, got a crit here. Um, oh, dear. So, oh, I didn't double it. Okay, so I'll double it. So it's seven. So you'll take seventeen points of damage for that hit. As one, what? As you start, how, how is it? How is it an odd number of damage? It's because you don't add the plus three oh, okay. um, to it. So you don't add the modifier. You just add the damage twice, and then you add the plus three. So it was four plus three plus three. So it was four plus three doubled, then plus three. Okay. So the um, 17. Yep, 17 points of damage as you start trying to step away and the boar just gets you with its tusk. You kind of trip a little bit, but you're able to continue on over. And then uh, as you're continuing to, the uh, the man boar also tries to take a hit at you and does so. Uh, for 24 crit. to hit. It's not a crit. <laughs> uh, but you do take... Uh, you do take 12 points of damage there. Okay. Because you're not raging, are you? I was about to. You will now. <laughs> so you, yeah. you can claim that you're raging now, but you did take okay. that damage. Right. So now I'm raging. I'm going to Great Axe, the boar that's still alive. Uh, get that. Which... Which color boar are you? Uh, yellow. Yellow? Okay, perfect. You just have to be, like, here to hit for it. I, I made the mistake yeah. before of you had to, you could be on diag diagonal, but you have to actually be on, like, a square on either side of it. Oh, okay, let me move uh, here then. Okay. Well, if that was the case, I would have just stayed where I was. Well. No, we don't have that, to, like, redo it, it's fine. That was my mistake before you can actually heal back your 12 points of damage because if you go here you would not have stepped away from the other from the man boar so you can heal the 12 points of damage to make up for it. Okay. but uh 11 uh, to hit let's see here 11 does not hit the regular boar um, okay i think i might be able to hold on i might be able to still Take a swing. I don't know if that means I have to hit what, first or not. When you rage, does it add to your attack or your hit? Remember how it doesn't it add? Okay, yeah, yeah, I can attack again. So you with can my extra again. attack, perfect. Yeah. So I'm gonna do that. Oh my god. Eleven. <laughs> uh, but it does say here you do have to when you are raging, you. Uh, you gain advantage on strength checks and saving throws, not attacks, plus two melee dam damage. That's what it is. Yeah, damage. Okay, yeah. Yeah. So you just swing at this board, just whoosh, whoosh, 
and it's able to just grunt at you and you're kind of roll can i do a bonus attack or a bonus uh action you can do a bonus action did you want to use a reroll sure go go for it go for it everybody okay i was waiting for like a a 40 go go Watch it be the same thing. Okay, we're good. Oh, there you go. So that good. hits. Good, let's go. Roll for your damage there. He's about to get knocked out. 11 points of damage, because that was to uh, the yellow boar. 11 points of damage. As he's just blood is starting to pour from his side as your axe just sinks into him a little bit, but he is barely standing, but still upright. This is a strong boar. Okay, and then my last action, can I just do an unarmed strike? Uh, so for your uh, for your bonus actions, you cannot. Oh, your bonus action was actually your rage. Your oh, okay. rage is a bonus action. Okay. Did you uh, add the plus two to damage? It does it automatically, I think. Yeah, yeah, it does it automatically does on it? my thing. Yeah, it, it's like not with the. So it would be six plus five, but like above that, it says like great axe plus two damage. I so like it does it before. But it also says great axe plus two to hit. Uh, so it the not plus two is to hit. So. I thought there was I a button that you, that you had would to hit. Add it automatically. Yeah, we I do you have, have to math it out. Yes, we do have to math it out. It's not there actually. It's thirteen, not eleven. Yeah, because um, the great axe plus two is your plus two to hit. That's just like the rank of your great axe. Yeah. So just remember, we need to add plus two to your attacks under this. Uh, okay. I thought that there's another button that you could press, like when you're like when you're in a rage, that would add plus two to all of it, which is. I thought it was doing it this whole time. Yeah, that's annoying. All right, so I'm going to take two more points of damage there. It can do, like, as crit, but I, that's only if you get natural 20, right? Right, exactly. Okay, well, yeah, I, I don't have a, another option. Yeah, that's... D&D Beyond is not perfect, unfortunately. We can try. Yeah, it. I have some spells that are, like... And then just add this. I'm wondering, it's, like, like, they don't have don't a button, really, that. that says, like, yeah, you're raging. Like, it'll yeah, do right. it if, like, some stuff, but not everything. Yeah, that I think they're, like, slowly trying to, like, get everything. But it is a lot to add, so... Yeah. It's tough. There's a lot of stuff. It's a lot. Okay, yeah. so what all can I do with my bonus actions? Or no, no, you said never mind. Right, so that's the end of your turn now. there. Yeah. So it's yeah. it's the boar you hurt there, who is just mindlessly looking at the person that hurt it and is going to take a swing or a, a tusk at you. Okay. <laughs> Yo. Oh. Thought it was gonna be a twenty again. Nineteen to hit. Hit. Yes. And that is, it's slashing damage, so it's halved, so you take five points of slashing damage. Okay. Right? Um, and that brings us to the, uh... Main... Wait, wait, I have... Oh, no, you already did it, never mind. You have what, sorry? It, you already did it, the resistance to slashing? Yes. Yeah, I'm good. So that is now, uh, it is now this one, this guy's turn, who is going to take a hit at Nickel because he's right in front of him. These aren't really intelligent creatures. They just are kind of going for what they can know here. Mm. He's going to try to hit her with her, with his tusk. And tonight that does hit for 23. Which which one's this? The red one. The red one, yeah. Okay. And that is I'm rolling well on my damage as well. Thirteen points of damage for nickel. There. Make sure she doesn't have any reactions she can do. Nope. Can't. That's okay. Um and that's the end of its turn there. It's the next where guys this one. And so uh the, he was just poison sprayed by this mysterious, very tall creature here. So he's going to start. He's going to back up a little bit and try and charge at you for his attack here. And mm-hmm. but he has to land a hit first. And so he's going to try and hit you with okay. his little tusky tusk. And I don't believe that's going to hit. That is a nine. Can I reach Which... that? Hmm? Can I react to that? Because I have Warcaster. Warcaster? 
Yeah, it says you can use your reaction to make an opportunity attack to cast a spell that has a casting time of one action and targets only that creature. Get shit on. Yeah, you can go That's for amazing. it. So cast a spell that has a casting time of one action. Okay, I have to figure out what that means real quick. Uh, a, so any of your spells, spell. yeah. Yeah. Any of my spells. Well, I want to entangle this bitch. All right. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do. Perfect. I'm just trying to so find So I need it. a constitution saving throw of... No, a strength. Wait, what? I don't know. You read this. I don't know. Oh, wait. A strength saving throw. I'm just trying to find entangle. Which spell slot is that? I casted it. It's the... Wait, wait, wait. Let me make sure. Yeah, first level. I'm doing that. I see. Oh, maybe you had were still working on your spells when I. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry. I switched out one spell because I was like, no, I don't want that. I want another one instead. So no, it's OK. Guys... I just so that <laughs> it just means I didn't see it. So. All right. Yeah. So grasping weeds and vines sprout from the ground and 20 foot square point within range for the duration. These plants turn ground area. A creature within the area cast spell must succeed a strength saving throw or be your string. All right, so the saving throw DC is 14. So let's, mm. let's do a strength saving throw here. And he Oops. missed on me, right? He did miss on you, yes. Awesome. Um, so he fails the strength saving throw, so he is considered entangled, which is very exciting. Let's go. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> this is a concentra uh, concentration spell, so if you cast another concentration spell, which is the one that has the little C next to it, that spell will end and the new one will take over. Um, yeah, that's okay. Yeah. I'll just need that. What did you say when it has that little uh, uh, C? That means it's a concentration spell. So you can only do gotcha. one concentration okay. spell. Okay, I was wondering time. what those were, but perfect. That's yep. perfect. Mm -hmm. And if you take damage, we have to do a check to see if you are able to uh, hold your concentration. You did not take okay, damage, fair. so you're good. So I'm that good. is the end of its turn. It's caught up and tangled up. I'm going to just put a little marker on him to signify yeah. that. And you'll have to try to get him out every time it's his turn, yeah? Yes. Okay, cool. Um, so it is Giant Boar B's turn here. And that is this guy right here. And so he is going to... He's going to try and he's... So he has to do 20 feet for his charge. So he is going to come back here and then charge at Nickel. because He has enough room to do it. For a hit there, see, four does not hit. Man, nobody likes to charge for him. That's all right. <laughs> but it is her turn, and she's pissed now. So she's going to uh, have her great axe out, and uh, try she's going to take a swing at the uh, one of the... If she does yellow... Boar, she can attack with advantage because of me. Oh, really? Okay, well, she's yeah. going to do that then. While you're raging, your allies have advantage on melee attacks rolls against any hostile creature within five feet of you. All right, so she is aware of that and totally doing it. And she... She's like, fuck it. Yeah, she needed it. So that is a 17 to hit, totally hits there. And she taken out that boar. She is upset right now. Uh, so she rolled a six for that, but she's actually going to use one of her superiority dies to, uh, um, do a, add the total, when you weapon dunk, you can spend one superiority die to add the total damage to the roll and allow the creature you can see or hear to use its reaction move half its speed without provoking opportunity attack for it. Um, she has one where it is, she gets to add oh, that's the attack roll. Okay. So it doesn't add to the damage there. So it's six points of damage for that boar, and he is actually, oh, that's actually enough to take him out anyway, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. As he falls to the ground and just grunts there. But she does have another attack for her turn, so she's going to go ahead and take that on the werebor. And, uh... 
It's actually going to take out the boar that is here, the other boar, because it's closer to Reese. And continued swinging on with her great axe here. Ooh, that's a crit. Heck yeah. All nice. right. And she's going to do crit damage and roll that. As she's just very upset that this is threatened by, this is threatening her wife. Oh man, the damage is not super awesome. So, um, oh, did it not crit? Hold on. That's crit weird. Damage. Yeah. Hold on. Did it do it here? For some reason, the crit damage is not rolling okay. for that. So what's, I'm just going to add what the... What is it, a 2d12? Oh, no, I don't have that. Uh, so it's just doubling minus the modifier. So I'm going to use the first roll because that's the fairest. And so we're going to take 4 doubled, which is 8, plus uh, 3. So there we go. Not out. 4 here. This is the hard part about having multiple, uh, the same like, creature. It's like, this one. Right. All right. So 11 points of damage there as she, her axe just comes down on this boar. Um, uh, it's not able to like knock it down, but did a lot of, uh, damage going on there. Um, yeah. and not... just, yeah, just see if it works. That's all. Just one moment. Uh, so is that Reese's turn now? Sorry. All good. <laughs> um, what happened? What did I miss? What who's dead? Who did she attack? The purple one? No, the yes, purple, the purple yeah. one. Yeah. How's he the, looking out of ten? If you I, get melee on the green boar, I can give you advantage. I would never because my <laughs> Can you imagine? Like I just I had to throw it out there. Yeah. Um I'm also gonna attack the purple one because I am visibly upset. Um I think it, this is probably the first time ever that we've they would have fought together, right? Like, they don't, I can't imagine they're getting a lot of like fights, right? Side by side. So I'm fucked off. So I'm gonna I'm going also for the purple one because who's to say? Um, I'm gonna throw that out there. Shit on. All right. Perfect. Um, click that because I've cast it. I'm throwing. Oh, holy fuck, gamers! All right, 20 points of damage there. So that boar is looking, starting to look a little bloodied, I dare say. And for my bonus action, I'm going to I'm gonna cast, like, Shillelagh. But if Shillelagh. I need to, I can use it. Yes. Yeah. Shillelagh. I bring out that quarter staff, and I'm very proficient. <laughs> totally fair. Not really, but who's to say? You are technically proficient with it. So that brings us to uh, Werebore, the one that is next to Dario, who is going to uh, try and hit Dario with that. Uh, he's going to use his maul this time. And is a 18 to hit. That hits. Perfect. Uh, and so you take... You can see it. Eight. Uh, so it is bludgeoning, so it's half four points of damage. I'm glad I'm remembering that. Part. Uh, and that brings us to Sage. What's going on in the little corner over here? Well, since I've tangled this guy up, I am going to just swiftly jump over him and move up to the red one, I think. No, right. wait. Let me wait. No, oh, hold on. Because now this guy don't have opportunity to attack just yet because he's trapped. So Correct. He does not. Um... Is there any way I can get close to the green guy up there and be within five feet of Dario? Uh, for no, like a you melee just attack? For, for, the, for yeah. the thing, you just gotta be... With, I have to be within five feet of the enemy, so as long as you can get to him. Oh, shit. Good. Okay, well, I'm just gonna... Is it, a, is it a melee attack that they have to do? Yeah, right? Yeah, yeah it's melee. 
Okay, so yeah, so you essentially you so have to I be can't. within five feet. So I can't do that. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna what the fuck. Um, the only, if you got how how far can you move? Thirty. Me? I think. Oh, hold on. How do it I? It is see thirty that? Oh, feet 30 too. Then. Yeah. yeah, I think it's exactly thirty. It is so thirty. You could feet. make it and stand next to the green one. Oh yeah, you're right. If you okay, want well, to do, do that attack like that. Yeah, I'm gonna jump up next to the green guy. All right, and, roll with uh, advantage. And we're like, who the fuck's that? Yeah, you <laughs> guys just fuck? see just this what massively tall, just adorable creature <laughs> just step know. on oh in. God. Oh, yeah, I should add, I have really big round yellow eyes, so kind of cute. Anyway. Or terrifying, um, depending on the context. I was about to say. Yeah. No, 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 she terrified. looks cute, okay? I'm she, looks, she looks like, wait, despite wait. her height, she looks like, like these yellow eyes. Like she could be small. Oh. Um, yeah. Yes, <laughs> like that. <laughs> okay. Let's do a. Uh, let me get my. Hold on. My quarter staff out. No, I'm going to do my scimitar and just uh, hit that guy. All right. Roll for your hit. No, wait. I'm sorry. I don't have to do melee attack, right? You, you have do to do melee attack advantage. for the advantage. That's right. Okay, yes. Yeah. Scimitar, go. All right. <laughs> sorry. I was misunderstanding. For a uh, roll it. Well, that actually hits. So you uh, roll it one more time in case you crit, though. But with advantage, right? No. Yeah, so with... if you guys forget to roll with advantage, just roll one more time and we take the higher roll. Yeah, I did okay. forget. My bad. No, it's all right. So 15 hits. So go ahead and do your damage there. Two. Two points of damage. Oof. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Hey, it's I'm something. Listening. It is. It is. Um, I don't know if I can do more. Can I do uh, hidden step? Hidden step? No. Do not you turn invisible guys. for the start of your next turn. Mr. Toast, thank you for the raid. I appreciate you. We're in the middle of combat, so we're going to be hopping in on this, but I just want to say thank you very much for that. Uh, you can turn invisible to the start of your next turn. You attack, deal damage. Uh, or force a saving throw once per shirt rest. So, yeah, you can, uh, yeah, go ahead. You can turn invisible. Because then he won't get an opportunity to attack, yeah? Correct. Mm -hmm. You did take all of your movement, though, so you won't be able to move again. You know, I'm, a. Uh... <sighs> Sorry, guys. Mmm... Nah, I'm not gonna do it. I'm just gonna stand tall as right. I am. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Dar, you just saw this seven foot, almost like a fawn looking type of woman just step down in front of you and just with, with wild, a scimitar just poke hair. this uh, <laughs> poke this werebore. What are you doing? I'm, I'm just amazed. I'm like, okay, okay. And I'm gonna Tola, pull Dario my great or the tall bitch? Huh? Who's taller? The tall Wait. bitch. Yeah. She's oh. only like six. She's seven foot tall. I am 6'3". Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna uh, great axe the guy. All right. As soon as I get back to my actions. There we go. Let's go. You know what's gonna hit? Oh yeah, that hit. You're out of there, kid! Nice! 16 and then I'm gonna hit again because I can do that. Plus two, don't forget. Oh plus no! Two, your oh yeah, so it's eighteen. Thank you. Eleven does actually hit the that. Yay! The boars for some reason have a higher AC than the wear boars. Lol. Okay, and so and then another damage. two damage. Uh, so ten. So ten, right? So is that is that twenty eight total? That guy's got to be that dead. That was twenty eight total, but he is not dead. He is looking <laughs> upset. Rerolled the he hit. Hurt? Oh, sorry. Sorry, I, I missed that, Laguerre Bear. Yes, we did get a re-roll, so please re-roll for your second hit there. The chaos. But it hit, right. We'll see. It could be a crit. It does hit again. So you okay, so I get to roll the damage again, because yeah, we had a re-roll. <laughs> Either way, the re-roll landed. No, you don't get what to roll the roll? damage again, nice no. Guy. No. No, it resets it to, like, what we had to do. No. Wow. Y'all are just here to gamble with me the whole time. Uh, 
And so that boar is dead, so it means it's this Thanks, boar's Belvedere. turn, who is really upset. Uh, wait, wait, no, not. Whose turn? Just say by colors, because I can't see who you're clicking. Yeah, well, no, please. I'm trying to figure out who it is because I have them organized by number because I can't label them uh, in my encounter. So okay. it's the red guy's turn. And he is going to try and hit Nickel. Um, and he's going to try and use his tusk here. With a 9 plus 5 is 14. I don't believe that hits her. No, it does not. It just bounces right off. She is upset. And that brings us over to the boar blue, uh, who is entangled. So we're going to use its turn to make a strength saving throw. Strength check needs to beat a 14, oh, 14 for yeah. it. Oh, it does not at all. <laughs> oh. So it's still stuck there. Moving on to mm -hmm. boar uh, B, which is this one. Yep, the purple one. And it is going to take a slash at, um, can take a slash at Nickel here, is who wow. did damage it last. And go. Um. Um. What? I'm okay with it. <laughs> did you damage it last? Yes. <laughs> it hits it. It's a for 11, so it doesn't matter who it's going for, so... It can come, I did attack it last, so I'll, I'll take the non-attack. There you go. So you took the non-attack. But it is Nickel's turn, and she is going to... Um, she's going to take her great axe and try and swing at... Please hit the blue one, or the red one. Uh, I'm very concerned about the red one. The red one? Wonderful. Well, yeah. she... It's still loading for it. 12 to hit. Even though she's mad because... She's mad. Well, she's, she's startled by the one that is closest to you, but that one she does recognize does have lower health. So she will go for the red one. Um, and so the damage there is... Oh, that was so close. Oh, nine. Nice. Uh, plus three. 12 points of damage. Then. That one is... Red is number one. 12 points of damage there. She's going to hit it again because she's fucking pissed. And that is a... That does hit. And so she's going to create some more damage. Uh, yeah, we'll take it. 8 points of damage there. Oh. For it's just continuing on. And she's going to use a superiority die to actually uh, attack... Um, the green guy right here as with a, where is it? Because she can use a... What? Like a hand axe? A quick toss maneuver for her superiority die, which means that as bonus action, you can expend one super superiority die and make a ranged attack with a weapon that has a thrown property. You draw the weapon as part of making this attack. If you hit the, add the superiority dies, damage to the weapon. So we're going to use her hand axe for that. And come on, 11 does hit, so she will be doing for the throne property there. It is five plus three plus an additional holy six shit. here, eight points of damage plus her superiority die. Fighters are cool. Ah, one, it's all right. Nine There's points like of damage. so much going on, it's a lot. Yeah. So fighters are fucking intense. So that Reese is, is having for... a moment, like a very like turned on, but also concerned moment. <laughs> she's that watched was... this whole thing happen, and she's like, "Holy fuck!" <laughs> Nine points of damage for the werebore that is starting to look a little startled and roughed up. Um, there, and that is the that is the end of her turn. Uh, oh, it's now Reese's turn. <laughs> Sorry, shit. fighters can have a shit ton of turns <laughs> if they want. Like, yeah. So yeah, I'm having my moment. Um, but, you know, I'm, I'm just, holy fuck. Um, okay. I am going to, so the last one I hit was, how's the purple one looking? What's the vibe check? The purple one? Uh, the purple one is, so that is, uh, he's looking like pretty, uh, he's starting to, he's not quite bloody yet, but he's looking agitated. 
Okay. You're not going to melee, thing... right? No, no, no. The good thing about okay, Witch so... Bolt is that I don't have to roll for the attack again. I can automatically target, like, a, like an I can automatically attack the same person that I've already attacked without roll. Like, I just have to roll for the damage mm -hmm. um, until I use another spell. So I'm going to, like, attack the same one again. That's the purple guy, right? Yes. Okay. So roll for it. Um... Da, 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 da. 18. 18. Ooh, and that is enough to Ooh, knock nice. that boar down. He Good job. Upset. Hell yeah! Just that bolt of like purplish lightning just shoots out from your hand and it just consumes this boar as it falls down and smoke starts rising from its. Uh, That's her. dinner. It is dinner. Is there anything else that you'd like to do on your turn? Uh, I don't think I could do anything else because. My only bonus action is Lele. Yeah, which I can't. Um, and I don't want to move because the green guy will touch me. So that is very. Can deal with it. Yeah. All right. If he touches you, I can get an attack on him. I'm. I'm gonna tell that. <laughs> I'm just gonna be like, yeah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna tell her that she's super hot though. You're gonna in the you middle of the battle. Right. Yeah. Like, That's hot, running. babe. As you'd yeah. seen that great axe come down twice and then Holy just a shit. axe. Throw. Yeah, and the fucking hand axe. I'm like. <laughs> You're well, here. You're you're bothered. <laughs> you know, hot and bothered. Yeah, I am. Uh, so that brings us to uh the green guy actually, who is going to uh see what happened to this boar, and mm. uh is going to make a hit towards Reese. Okay. Here, with a that's only eleven to hit, so it misses. Oh, uh, I can attack him. You can attack him, so attack With my essential attack. Uh, cool. That's gonna hit. That does hit, yep. So For ten? Eight points of, oh, ten points of damage, thank you. Ten points of damage. The werebor. Uh, blood is starting to like stream from the side of his head as he's like trying to just keep upright. Wasn't really expecting that attack at all and just growls at you. Uh, rawr. Yeah, rawr. Uh, it is... <laughs> Sage's turn. What's going on? Well, since... Uh, so the green boy is not looking too good, yeah? Correct. So it doesn't take much more, but I think I'm actually going to leave that to the buff guy. Wait, uh, Han, one more thing. When yeah. I hit a creature with an opportunity attack, they take... Their speed becomes zero for the rest of the... Uh, the well, I guess it doesn't matter. Wait, what? Their what? It says like when they when you hit a creature with opportunity attack, the creature's speed becomes zero for the rest of the turn. Okay. But like it doesn't matter since this turn is up, right? So it will be like so on its next turn. Um He's zero. Yeah. Okay. Or yeah, I guess it yeah, I'll just say it's zero for the next turn too. Cool. Okay. Alright, so what are you doing, Sage? Well, I can tell that they seem to have it covered up here, so I'm gonna move down to where the purple was. All right, you will have I'm the a, opportunity of attacking. No, I'm not. He'll... I'm not gonna move. Okay, I'm not gonna move. I'm gonna stay where I'm at, <laughs> and I will pull out my whip with thorns on it. So it's called the whip, the thorn whip. All right, and I am gonna swing it at. Wait, so how is it looking? How's everyone looking? Green like fucked. A... Red's oak. Like blues on. Well, I think the other two are fine, right? It's just the green one that looks fucked. Yes, you get advantage if you melee him again. Yeah, but I only him though. Really want that whip out. Wow, uh, I'm just <laughs> saying. Things. You don't have to. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? I'll do that. Actually, going on in this fight. Okay, 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 okay. I well, am also gonna... consider like if you just to consider things like your scimitar. Although you have advantage, it's a one d six damage, and you have a plus three you to like your me. hit. Whereas your thorn yeah. whip has a plus six to your hit, and it's two d six damage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's literally but that's double not a the melee. damage if you hit. Right. I'm yeah, just saying, it... you have a higher you have a higher chance of hit, like because you have it's a plus six for hit. like it's eleven to hit. So yeah. So right, I'm just I'm saying just... if you'd like to, I'm just like letting you know. Well, that... I was thinking of kind of spreading out the damage a bit more in case there was somebody that wasn't standing or that was standing taller than this one, you know. But um, the range of Thorn Whip is thirty feet. I know, that's why I'm like, I have the option of hitting every one of them, but only one. So, 
I think I'm gonna go for the. I'm gonna still go for the the red one actually. The red one, okay. And do the thorn whip. All right. So roll for your hit. Holy shit! This wait. Did I? Yeah, I don't have advantage me. now. Correct, but it does hit. So it's please dark. roll for your damage. Uh, As you guys see this uh, thorned whip just shit. fly over you, just <laughs> on top, and just bonk this guy right on the head. With fucking precision. Yeah, with nice. four points of damage for him. Which one? He. Hello. Like you. Hello. That one. Hello. Hello. Four Hello? points of damage to the werebore as he's looking very upset for just having these like little thorns just line his face. Mm-hmm. He's mad. All right, uh, and that brings us over to Dario. You know, Dario. I'm about to kill both these fuckers. Uh, <laughs> great axe. All right, who are you great well, axing? Uh, the one next oh, the, to me. The green one, yeah. 15, 15 hits. He's he's about to fucking die. Get ass blasted. Let's go. <laughs> Fifteen points of damage to Four twenty. Big D. Here. 15. Uh, so it's actually 17 points of damage. He is just barely holding on here. Fucking <laughs> way. It's like he falls to a <laughs> okay, knee okay, okay. and I'm starts going... to push himself back up. Okay. Uh, I'll great axe him again. <laughs> oh no! Nine. Unfortunately, Oops, misses. Like you get so right excited now. with that damage, don't you? Can do you, I. Uh, do you want to uh, use a reroll? Reroll. Can I just I attack again? Yeah, we with my, need it. Yeah. With my bonus. Oh, okay. With your bonus. So, so your bonus action here is. I got uh, unarmed. But... So unarmed, like because unarmed, you have to actually like you're using a two-handed weapon, so you can't use an unarmed strike. I'll use my fucking head pond. No, nope, that's not how that works. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Then with my uh, actual bonus action, I just want to move. I'm going right. to move. Uh, can I make it to in between the... Oh, I want to go there. Yeah, you can I totally can. do that. You have an opportunity of attack put on you. His movement is zero. He can't fucking touch me. Yeah, but it's as you're moving, he is swinging. God damn it. Okay, I think I have something for that. But yes, opportunity. All right, well, you look. I don't I'm know where it is. For my damage, we're gonna roll for my hit, and he's also like desperately trying to hit you because he of course. is upset. Oh, it was so close to sixteen. Nice. Ah, uh, that misses. So you are able to get away swiftly. Fuck off, boy. Finish mm-hmm. him off, Reese. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that brings us to. Uh, where more A is uh, the red one here who saw Dario just jump in here and is going to uh, you know what he's going to take a hit at him see how that goes no hit somebody else uh, that is a more. 19 plus 3 24, 24 to hit sorry mm-hmm. uh, and you're going to end up taking I can't see what it is. Seven points. Of, uh, so, so it is. Uh, we round down. So three points of damage. Awesome. For that. Done. Flashing damage. Uh, and can you also roll a constitution saving throw for me? Okay. Okay. Everything's fine. <laughs> Fuck. What the Let fuck? Let seem a little. She's disappointed, disappointed. right? <laughs> uh, like, so that oh, brings man. us to the the boar that is all tangled up and just hanging out by himself. Mm-hmm. Uh, he's trying to overcome a fourteen. He does it, so he's able to break free from the entanglement there. Mm-hmm. Um, and is going to then use his. So now my concentration is back. Yes, your concentration's back. Well, technically, it's the entangled spell is still in effect because it's in that area. Uh, so it can still be in effect if you want. But he's going to boop, 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 and then uh, charge at Dario here. This is the first line. No. Trying to get a straight line to do a charge attack here. 
And so we're going oh, to... No. Oh no, oh no, oh no. All right. That hits. So you take... Fuck off. Uh, you take... That's going to be a plus three. So seven points of damage. Uh, plus... An additional four points of damage. Um, and please uh, do a strength saving throw. Did you say like 11 total? Seven plus four? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Damage and then a strength saving throw. I'm fucking Dario, mate. All right, then you are fine. You have not been knocked down prone. All right. Hell yeah. And that's the end of its turn there. Take off the spider web. Infected. Right. And it's now Nickel's turn, who is just seeing. Uh, so she is going to try and she's happy that at least there's uh, two creatures that are in the way uh, between Reese and herself, at the very least, and also Dario. So she's going to take her great axe and try to hit the red guy. Advantage. With advantage, oh yes. She is enjoying this advantage here. Oh, crit? Man, I've rolled several crits tonight. <laughs> All right. hours. Yep. <laughs> All right, let's see if the crit will actually roll for it. Well, she's a part of a team now, so... Technically, awesome. Yeah, I think it's... Because you get two, de like, two d12 instead of one, so I think that's what it is. Oh, I see it's what the, it was the, doing it's now. That you're, the, the second roll has just been really shit for you, so... Right. I see. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yep, that's been it. Yeah. So 11 points of damage. There we go. So it's, you know, it's it's doing its best here for that one. Uh, which number is that one? Ladle guard. Uh, that one is that one. So that actually takes him out. Damn. Oh, wait, no, it's not that one. Sorry. I was oh. looking. I mixed him up. Oh, greens. Yeah. Greens, the one that is oh, getting my eyes on that motherfucker. Yeah. So she's going to take another swing at it uh, with advantage again. Um, and she's actually going to use, um, Layla. she's going to use a, <laughs> she doesn't need to use a pre precision attack because she already has advantage on it. So She's actually just going to keep it straight up. Okay. Fighters, man. Wow. I'm telling you, fighters. Advantage roll for that. Yeah, maybe another crit? No. But it does hit. We'll take it. Or a whopping uh, 10 points of damage. So that, it's, it's happening. It's getting there. For it. Uh, now it's Reese. Hmm. Well, I have a question first. Okay, so like I'm looking at my attack actions and it has Shalele under as a bonus action attack. So does that mean that this whole time I can also hit people? No, to, so it's, I looked this up because it was very confusing. Yeah, because I'm confused. Right, you can cast Shalele? Because I, like, I got like attacks, not right. actions. And then down the bottom it says bonus action, and that's where I rolled to attack with it in the bonus action section. So right. I'm confused. <laughs> it's confusing. I had to look it up. Yeah. To attack, you're using your attack, but to cast your lele, okay, cool. you it's use the bonus your, it's the bonus action. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm not gonna do that. I was just curious because I was like, it just looks really confusing. Yeah, it doesn't um, make sense the way it's on there. Yeah, but I'm gonna fling some fire at that green motherfucker. That that totally hits. Yeah, he, we're not buddies. That's rude. Oh, wait, it's a 10. It's 14. Get shit on. <laughs> that's I, I, I thought it was a zero, and I was like, what you mean? All but right. that's a 10. And that is enough to take that's him out. Am I just killing everyone? Is this you, a bit like... You are killing hello? everyone. Hello? Yeah. <laughs> you are, as this guy Big is flex. just... The fire just consumes this boar, and it falls to the ground, just, again, smoking very similarly. 
Mm. All right. Does 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 my wife think that I'm cool, or is it just like <laughs> she a... does? She kind of like raises her brows at you, kind of like mm, nice. <laughs> uh, and now it is Sage's turn. What's going on? Well, I am. How's the group looking? All good. I think Dario might have taken some damage. I'm like half halfway healthy. Halfway dead. Oh yes. Glass empty full, you know. Mm. I took okay. a, a total forty something points. You're the barbarian. Just 40. It's fine. Hell yeah, I'm but fine. That's that. Do they look like they're okay though? Like it's not too bad. That is, yeah. upon your judgment, you do see that he's, you know, he's lost half his, like, stuff, so he's bleeding pretty profusely. My okay. head hurts. Mm. Okay, I'm trying to look at my healing spells real quick. Because there's one way I have to touch, and then there's one where... I can cast it, basically, from 60 feet, right? Right. So, but, uh, Cure um, Wounds is a more powerful spell, and you have to touch, whereas Healing Word is a less powerful spell, but you can say it from 60 feet away. Please exactly. touch me, Leaf Woman. <laughs> um, so, what if I do a second level Healing Word or Cure? Yeah, I have to touch him, too. Okay, well, I got nobody on me, so I could really move up to him and put a hand on him if I wanted to. It's all up to you. So I'm going to move up to Dario. All right. I'm going to put a hand on his shoulder, mm -hmm. and I'm going to cast Cure Wounds on second level. All right. And I so just kind of flinch at the, at, the, at the feeling of, like, this bush touching me. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> what the at fuck? this bush oh. touching me. Okay. So you heal Dario for 15 points. Nice. Hey, that's really good. Thank you. Potion? We don't need fucking Yash. Yeah, fuck that. Dang. Fuck Yash. <laughs> fuck Yash. Is there anything else you'd and like to do? that's my turn, yeah? Perfect. I can't do any more, right? So Dario, uh, a okay. friendly hand reaches out to your shoulder and you feel this warmth as some of your cuts start to heal themselves and close up. And now it's your turn. Am I bright enough to know that it's coming from the bush yes. woman? Yes. Okay, cool. <laughs> the fuck? I just look. I I like. I, I don't know what to say to her, but I just look like my with kind eyes. Like, thank you for healing me. Uh, and then I'm gonna pull out my great axe and slice her. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I'm gonna slice a boar, a boar man. I'm gonna go for. Can nice. I? Can I do like a spin attack? Um, I'll let you do a spin attack if, but you're using both of your attacks to do so. Uh, but if he does a spin attack, won't he? Hit well, I'll, yeah, I'll just go with what I just rolled. The so there we go. Like, I mean, I'll it'd be it. a cinematic spin attack, is what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. That you can use both your hits and it, like, like in the oh, theater of mind, like you'd be spinning or something. <laughs> no, I mean, I'm, I'm not going to hit you. I'm only spinning like the 90 degrees to get the two of them. Uh, yeah. Okay, so. I did 20, so go to hit just once? Yes. So go to, so uh, you'd have to still roll to hit to for the hit for the <sighs> second one as well. So oh, okay. Six okay. points Thank of damage God. for the, I'm Eight guessing the blue one? Eight sure. points of damage. Eight, Eight points, points of you. damage. You, is then... that for the blue one first? Yes. All right. Or actually, it was the, yeah, yeah, for the blue one, for the blue one. All right. And then, okay, so you said do hit again. Yes. I almost critted. Fuck me. That does hit, though. And the second one is for ten, 10 points, points of, damage. of damage. Let's go. As that uh, that werebore there is looking pretty rough, is having trouble. He kind of stumbles a little bit, trying to stay upright. He just glares at you. All right, and it is his turn. That's, that's my turn. Yeah. He's mad. But he's actually going to uh, take a swing at Nickel instead. Yeah. So roll for yeah. Go. Eighteen totally hits. And that is going. 
seven points of damage to Nickel. And then I can attack him. Yes. And he actually gets a second attack he is able to make, so he is going to uh, use his maul well, as well. Can I attack him before he makes that attack? Yeah, you can. Go for it. Okay, so 15 on, on 15. him. I did both the things. Perfect. So, that does... Uh, you, oh, you did both the things. Perfect. 15 points of damage there. I, I just assumed that a 27 would hit, you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you did. Uh, and that is actually enough to take him out. So that is, he is done, Zo, for that. Empty nickel? Yeah. And so your axe just comes down as he tries to swing at nickel, or try to swing at nickel with his uh, maul after hitting her with a tusk and just, just cracks his skull into the ground. <laughs> Um, but I do need Nicole to make What are these saves for? Tell I don't us. know. Getting knocked uh, over. Uh well I'm about Maybe to tell you as Nicole has this gash on her arm from the boar's tusk. Um uh, and she doesn't really notice it right now as anything significant. Um, but uh you guys might notice it a little bit later. That's all. Is she gonna turn into a boar person? A werewolf. <laughs> Oh no! Oh shit! Uh, okay, so can I suck? Can I suck her arm? No. Uh, well, we'll like we'll discuss what happens. We'll discuss what happens <laughs> once the once the combat's over. Um, reroll. So reroll. Do you guys want to reroll? Like, sure. no, no, no. We gotta we gotta let some things take their course, guys. Okay. I, I vote no on the reroll. Okay. Oh, okay. So it's uh, wearable or B's yeah. turn. Hold on. Let me And uh, he's going to go for Dario because that's the last person. Attack him, and he's upset. And oof, that is a eleven to hit. Does not hit there. He is trying to use his ability to do another hit on you, though. Here okay. and nope, same roll does not hit again. Because Four, fourteen doesn't hit. No. Yeah, I'm fifteen. Great. So it's Nichols' turn. And she fucking raging. If she could rage, but she's a fighter. But she's going to take her hand axe and she's going to throw it right at that uh, werebore there. Her other hand axe. Oh? Wait, did you oh. do the advantage? Uh, no, I did not. So I'm going to roll it one more time. Because that was a one. <laughs> Sorry? No, I'm happy to do that. Uh, 23. That is way better than a Whoa. critical failure. Uh, and that does hit, so she's gonna... Ooh, max damage there. So great. So that's... That thing's OP. Nine points of damage for... Which thing's OP? The Dario's, like, wolf thing. Oh, yeah, it's I nuts. It is. Yeah. I really enjoy it. Uh, so she, she whirls her hand axe in through uh like right past dario's head aiming very well to embed itself into this werebore and then she's charging forward with her axe to take her second hit um here advantage uh with advantage should i yell this out every time yes because i forget <laughs> every time okay. i'm i'm on the Please struggle do. bus oh my god it's crit <laughs> nickel is the ultimate critter Oh my god, that's hilarious. All right, come on, do, do good damage for both of these. Oh my god, thank you. This is what I'm talking about for damage on a crit. 21 points of damage. He's Fuck out of there. Yes. And yep, he is dead as she just, just jumps up. So yeah, she throws this hand axe, it embeds itself in her and in, uh, in it, and then she just comes by and just like, swings right in half and just cleans him in half. Nice. As the last enemy falls to the ground. Oh. <laughs> And then I immediately, like, shift towards the bush woman. <laughs> Who the fuck are you? Uh, Nickel pulls out the axe from the uh, werebore and has it, like, ready to throw at her and says, Who are you? Like, in tandem at the same time as oh. Dario. Who Whoa. are you? First of all, I am legging it up to her, and I don't even care if she's mad at me. I've, like got her by the face and I'm full sending into a kiss. You don't get a you don't you don't get a choice. It's happening. 
<laughs> she does let that happen. Uh, yeah, she would. Yeah. And so she, uh, so she had grabbed her hand axe, is about to say, who are you, as Dario says it at the same time, but is then, like, pulled into this intense kiss. Mm. Wait, she kisses way. me? Never no. mind. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, so, Sage, this is the scene that folds before you. Unfolds oh, my. What? Some gay Do shit. I... It's, it's, hey, it's, mate, it's I'm Dario. Funny. Those are my lesbians. <laughs> what? <laughs> lesbians, you know, girls on girls. Like Drake what? said. I'm not sure I understand what that means, but okay, hello. Not like this. <laughs> nice um, to meet you I'm guys. busy. I'm busy. Who are you? Oh, I'm, my name is Sage. Yeah, and, like, uh, where, where'd you come from? What are you doing in the bushes? What's oh, going on, well, mate? Uh, so, funny story, um, I was approached by the squirrel one day as I was out wandering in the woods and stuff, and then it told me about you guys going on this world mission to save, you know, everyone and everything, and it was kind of relevant to me because um, there was this uh, destruction in uh, my home, and I... Yeah, so, um, yeah, I don't know where to start, but um, a squirrel came to me, then a, a knight, an, oak, an owl came to me telling me about you guys, like a group of people were going, and um, that I should go and find you, and they had heard it. Um, Has then... anyone mentioned the words, uh, letters, ADHD to you before? No. And then a weasel came to me, and then oh finally a raven came to me. And the, the raven was too important because it was from Natali, and it told me that everything that the animals had told me was actually true, and I had to do something about it because I can't stand the unbalanced areas in, in my home, which is, if you were wondering, the woods, so yeah. Um, and I was like, hey, why not help you guys out and just, you know, tag along if you guys are okay with that? Well, um, we don't know you. Like, can you like prove that? Where, like, where's your raven at? Oh, flew away. Like, right after. Do you have the squirrel? Or... No, 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 no. Listen, Did they sign I... a letter? No, no. I Do you have a I raven's feather? <laughs> I talked to them. You know, like they. they are there they... are there any ravens around right now? Uh, make a perception check. I'm also not listening to what this bitch is saying because I'm just no, they're just like out. full on making no, out. Good. And I'm like, and I'm like, I'm really sorry, I'm so fucking stupid. And I like I promise <laughs> I'll go and apologize to Yaj. Like, I don't like I you know. And you can see that Nicole is very caught up in this. Um Yeah. So yeah, this is some Dario and Sage one on one. Yeah, time. for sure, for sure. Uh, so you do see <laughs> two actually people, two people in this conversation are just talking way too much, and one of them is me, and one of them is her. So <laughs> like... <laughs> perfect. So Dario, you do see up on the tree line. There is uh, there there have been ravens following you this whole time, and they're like high up to watch this battle unfold. Um, and you're able to spot one. Um, yeah. So can I right can I call one? Tree. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, great, Raven, I beseech thee. <laughs> and it, it swoops down and it lands on the, the log here and um, goes, ah, yes. Sweet Dario, how are you doing? Wow. Don't call me sweet, the fuck? You do recognize this <laughs> is the same Raven it. that you often have a repertoire with. I don't remember. <laughs> Anyways... This, uh, what'd you say your name was again? Sage. And then Sage. Like... This Sage, is she, is she, is she a friend of Natalie's? Well, friend is a very, um, strange word, but she's a, a devout follower. Um, Are you using her like you're using us to, to, like, save the world and shit? Well, the person who could have healing abilities for your party here did stay behind with some children so she thought it best to send someone to help protect you all action she did heal me she did Reese, are you are you almost unsogging 
Uh, and they they seem busy with their mouth over there. I don't know what's going on. It's called a kiss. Some, some gay shit. Yeah, some very gay shit. Oh, but we stand it. Nickel stand does it. like pull away, and she like looks and like has this bright red blush on her face, and looks at Reese again. She says, "We'll we'll we'll talk about this soon." Like, yes, yes, to everything, uh, yes. Okay, you guys weren't comfortable with me, but like. You're just like making out with all these dead bodies around, so like, the fuck? I'm just saying, like, mate. I, I just, I, I'm sorry. Could you say that all again? And she does ask for re explanation, <laughs> not realizing that <laughs> Sage had gone on quite a while. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen, listen. Let me clear it up for you. Sage, Sage got sent here by a squirrel and a bird. And no, she's no, a no, follower of the Tali. No, 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 Sage, that. you don't have to go through it again. It, trust me. Oh. What, we got, they trust me. We, we got it. We got it. Okay. I got the whole message. Well, why wouldn't they trust you? <laughs> exactly. I'm Dario. Oh, that's I'm the name? leader of this group. Yeah, it's Dario. <laughs> it's your boyfriend. Really nice name. Is your name like Sage Freebush or something? <laughs> no, no. No. What the fuck? No, this is leaves. And like, I, I made all of this myself. What oh do you God. think? Oh, it's very, very beautiful leaves. Thank you. Are you are you a a fur bog? Yeah, that, exactly. I've I've never met one before. I, well, I, I'm not often outside the city. It's wait, I'm we lost a one. Member. Oh no! I like how you see it in character. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Come back. There we Come go. Back. Your lights are also. Like, Good either night. somebody's talking or I, and then I was like, no, I'm just not moving. It's definitely me. Yep, it's you. Welcome back. Fine, Fine. I don't know what happened. Because everything well, else is cool. All good. Uh, so. Uh, what I miss? I wasn't really listening. Hold, anyway, hold so on, so hold on. Okay. <laughs> uh, sorry, I just lost my train of thought now. Oh, uh, Nicole asked. You're a furbolg. Furbolg. I've never met one before, and so mm -hmm. the yes, exactly. See, you, you're so smart. What's your name? I am smart. Thank you. My name is Nicole. Uh, this is my oh, wife, you. Reese. Oh uh, wow! What's that? What's that? Not like this. Oh my! Oh my wife. We are uh, together in a partnership. You know, surely you you have a yes, parent, right? Yes, exactly. You're right. Oh well, that's really nice. You guys are so cute together. We are. I mean that that whole action that happened. I'm not sure of what to 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 say or think of that, but it looked like you both enjoyed it. And there's a deeper red blush that's just crawling over Nicole's face. She says, "Well, so you're saying Natalie sent you?" Yes, exactly. Do you know her? About her? Not personally. Are you devoted to her? Uh, sounds creepy. All of those things are. <laughs> um, Reese, uh, these are familiar grounds for you. Are you? Mm. Are you, you familiar know, with furballs? God is of nature and light, so how can I not follow her? I mean, you do sound like someone I used to know. So, wow. Okay. <laughs> Not like this. I thought we were on the mend. And we are. We are. Okay. <laughs> um, she said, well, did this raven confirm this? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Wonderful. yeah I did. Wonderful. <laughs> uh, well, if she was sent, what, what do you all think? Well... Sage, we're we're on the way to like v Vier day? Vier yes. day? Oh, Vier day. Well, yes. Vier day. Did, I know did that the place. did the raisin tell you anything about that? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, of course. You're going for the sword. Oh, okay. So you really do okay. I I, I trust her. I trust her now, hmm. Reese and Nickel. I mean, we do need a healer. Can I cast Do not like play uh, me, guys. If anybody is yeah. hurt, by the way, let me know. I will help you right away. I'm very hurt. I'll make you feel so much better. Oh my god. No, this Just one sage. moment. Benjamin, let's, thank uh, you so uh, much for the raid. 
I just wanted to take a minute for that. We appreciate it. We're in the middle of some RP right now, but thank Perfect you. Perfect timing. All right, go for Sage, it. Sage, I want. Oh, Sage, I want you to make me feel better, love. Of yeah. course. Can um, anything you how's, want? How's it? It how's how's my bay looking? Can I? Does she seem like like you not any meta? Wounds, but does I she seem like them. she took a decent chunk of damage there? She, um, so she's not feeling okay. Roll everyone who is trying yeah. to investigate, like who, who's feeling I good, need to who's check hurting. On everyone for sure. You need to check on everyone. I just so, want to know if Sage is trustable. Perception? Investigation. For me, too? Investigation? No, I don't know. Investigate. Oh, myself. I'll investigate for like sure. Like I did at the... No, Pond. Isn't it perception? I'm sorry, but... Nope, you, because you are investigating a person. Perception is being aware of your surroundings, but you are investigating. Gotcha. All right. Oh, yeah, I All can right. do that. So, so, 10 for me. Ten for you. So, uh, so as as you're taking a look at everyone, you do notice that there are a few scrapes um, and wounds on you know the whole party, just a little bit. However, Dario, oh, you were uh, you were able to recognize that um, kind of your connection with nature, with your totems and everything. Um, also, one moment. Just welcome everybody. There's lots of you here, so I hope you're having a wonderful day. Um, but you notice uh, that the gash on Nicole's arm seems to be uh it has kind of like a strange look to the blood about it um and you realize you're able to make the connection that you're fighting werebores um and that the moon out the moon is out can i suck oh, on her gosh. arm <laughs> real quick yes uh so roll roll medicine are you telling anyone what's going on oh Including yeah like, Nicole? guys <laughs> guys i'm pretty sure you know, she might be turning into a werebore in a minute here. I'm I'm gonna try to suck out the the stuff and I just grab her arm and start sucking. And so Do you, you, want me to you just grab like, Yeah. Uh so you just yeah. grab Nicole's oh. arm after you say this and she's like oh. potting and but she like, you know, she kinda jerks away at first, but you're very strong. And so you're able to uh yeah. grab her arm. And you're able to successfully uh extract the poison from her system that would have been cursed. Um, oh, but what about Dario now? Is he a gun of your guy? No, I spit the poison out. I'm not swallowing it. You spit, don't swallow. What the fuck? <laughs> Ray Possum, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the oh, pond. No yes, Welcome werewolves. The pond. And Ben, Ben, thank you so much for the follow as well. Welcome to the pond. Welcome to the pond. The pond. Oh, and Imp. Oh my arrow. goodness. Oh my goodness. There's so many of you. Welcome to the pond. Imp. Da pond. It's da pond. Come to the pond. There's lots of sucking going on. There's lots of sucking going uh -huh. on. Yeah, we're sucking yeah. off. Aw, thank that's, you. <laughs> that, that's like her first interaction with a man ever. Yes, yep. and she looks Physically. pretty mortified from it, but she is thankful that you were you did extract that from uh, her wound right. and spat it Did it taste out. like anything? It tasted like... Uh, like egg whites? I would say it tasted a little bit like For you guys, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no, the egg I don't know. Like it. <laughs> oh, I did not make that connection. Did not taste so like that at all. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> did not make that at all. Mr. Toast knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> um, oh my god. Oh my god. So you all are able to. Well, while all of this is going on, I'm yeah. starting to um, prepare to smoke some trees. Smoke some trees, some yes. herbs. What the yes. fuck? <laughs> so I like to. So you just sit on fire, and I'm like already feeling comfortable that everyone has accepted me. So I'm over there, just you know, smoking my trees. And I asked for permission first, of course. I would never just take from nature. Uh, so you asked, okay, like, three? Or what do you... Anyone want some? Oh. Uh, no, no, thank you. No, thank you. It's really um, good. It makes you just calm down. It's so help. nice. You know, Sage, I'll, I'll take a little. Yeah? All right. My time in brothels, I'm very, I'm very well familiar with, with this. Oh, okay. You got any bath salts? Oh my god. What? <laughs> and Nicole's like, she's he's just joking. He's just joking. Well, thank you for for joining us on this. I know it's not an easy quest at all. 
Oh, no worries. It will be just fine. I'm sure you say that now. Yes. Yes. I mean, you guys seem to have it all under control just now. I'm not worried for you, really, but I'm curious about where this is, you know, gonna go eager for adventure. And also, yeah, I need this to get sorted out because it's not good for the woods or any of it or my people. So, yeah. Is is the dragon causing trouble within the woods? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it just flew right over our heads, but did not miss one of our cabins at all. So, half the Are you people's... homeless? Yeah. Oh. I mean, oh. Well, we kind of have you? to rebuild, you know, oh. everything of the people oh. that we have left, because we lost a lot during this destruction. So, I'm out here just trying to follow the light as... Natalia leads me, if you want. At least that's I'll... what I believe. So it brought me to you guys. I have a question for you, Sage. What's up? Can you swim? Can I swim? Where we're going, you're going to need to, to know how to swim. Well, I don't know if I can swim. Wait, are you asking me fuck? this? DM. No, I'm asking... It's up to you if your character Sage. can swim or not. Oh, yeah, of course I can swim. I can just... <laughs> yes, I can swim. What am I thinking? Okay, back in character, y'all. Okay. It's, yes, the, can... it's the weed. I can swim? What you mean? Like, in water and stuff? Yeah. I can just change into, like, a dolphin or a whale or a turtle or something. Like, it's not a big deal. You could shapeshift? Yeah. Oh! Well, it's you know, where cool. we're from, that's not really, like, a common thing, so... Really? Excuse our surprise. Yeah. Huh, what's what common, else can you do? Then, where you're from? I can do a can lot. Can you give yourself a dig of tits? Yeah. Daria, it's those aren't the priority. questions you should ask. I can. No. Mm. No one's asking for that. You should show Don't. us, Sage. No. But, you know, it would it would demand a lot of, like energy and stuff for me and I don't think that maybe it's worth it right now but hey maybe something <laughs> um so Nicole had watched as Reese walked over to her sleeping mat and she sits down next to her and she says are you alright I don't I don't even know <laughs> what to think well, if we can assume that she's from these woods mm. and the dragon has laid destruction to them, that means other individuals that live in the woods might have also been harmed. I, I did make that connection. And... What? Like, I don't know what you want me, like, to say. Like... She, uh, she sighs and just grabs that bottle and places it next to Reese. I don't need to do that. I appreciate, you know, like... Like, you, you know, I... Like, I guess, severed that connection a long, long time ago and... As, as like, fucked as it sounds, like, whatever happens to them has nothing to do with me anymore anyway, and it hasn't for a long time. Like, I made that choice. Um, I continued to make that choice when I decided, you know, to stay with you and you're the only family that I have and that's like that's where my loyalty and my priority is. What are you investigating, Sage? Reese. Sorry? I'm mis um, I wanna investigate Reese whenever. Reese? Mm -hmm. Go for Meaning, it. Meaning like see if what her problem is. <laughs> uh well so they're talking relatively quietly, however are it, Reese? Are you trying to? But be I quiet? haven't gotten to talk to Reese yet. So that's yeah, why yeah, I'm yeah. Like, I don't think so. like, I don't, I don't 
really yeah so they're not really trying to hide the conversation so you're able to just like approach on over it. like well, what I'm if just, she I'm... say to what i said yeah well, finish up first of course okay sorry no 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 i just wanted to well i wanted to make sure everyone had their turn so <laughs> um she said well it's still your family and yeah there's reason to be upset there I I know it has nothing to do with you anymore, and that's something that was decided decades ago, but you can still be upset for that. Yeah, I'm going gra- to take the bottle that I spent all my money on, and I, I'm going to pour it out, like the whole thing. Hmm. And I'm just going to be like, I, I, I have made a lot of mistakes today and I've upset you a lot and like I've fucked up a lot and I just want to do right by you. So I don't need this. And she smiles and says, well, would have thought it would have taken a dragon to get you to pour out a bottle, but, uh. Thank you. I'm going to put my heart out here and that's what you want to say? Okay. But she also notices uh, Sage scooting closer with interest. Oh, no, I'm not scooting. You're not scooting? Okay. I'm getting up and I'm just squatting right in front of Reese because they're laying down, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, they're they're like sitting on the ground. Yeah, okay. I'm just joining right next to Reese and I'm sitting down and I'm like with my my tree in hand. <laughs> um, I'm like, hey, so um, I never caught your name. What's your name? Um, well, I, I think that she told you, but um, my name is Reese. I forgot. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's I'm all good. No worries. You were good. The tree is so strong tonight. But I was thinking, um, you look a little stressed out. So here. So I hand her. <laughs> I am all good. Better. Thank you very much. No, really. You really No, no. It. No, I don't. I don't. I'm fine. Are you sure? Because it's I'm like, very hey, smart. we are n- no peer pressure here. Thank you. Uh, oh, I was just trying to be nice. That's all. Oh, oh absolutely, and we we do appreciate she looks it. Sad. You okay? Yeah, I think I'll. I think I'll manage. Do you need a hug? Mm, not from you. No you offense. just should do what you did just before. You seem so happy right after. Okay. Well. <laughs> hey, I'm just saying. Like, yeah, you you guys should be happy. Nickel and does take Reese's hand. And that. And I just say to Dario, like, I don't think they like me very much, but hey. <laughs> oh no no no! You're good. You're good. You are you are you the one like kind of like. I don't even know. Are you? Are you? Are you okay? Like, is oh, your tree good? Because I kind of felt like I kind of feel like I'm about to die. Like my mouth's really dry. <laughs> you know, I think I'm gonna die. No, 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 no. This is perfectly normal. I, I need to go. I need to go. I need to go. You're not gonna die. It's okay. It's I, okay. I, I, I'm leaving. I stand Dar- up Dar- and Dar- I drink some water. I'm like walking around in a circle. Here, here. I got some water. I pull out my water. Skin. I, I, I listen, listen. Stop, 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 stop. stop. Listen to me. Listen to me. I have to go. I have to go. I gotta go back to town. I gotta go to the fucking doctor or something. I don't know. I gotta no, go. No, 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 no. Listen, I'm basically... Oh. I can help you if you need it. Like, whatever it is. <laughs> I don't know. It's your fucking trees. It's your trees, man. The trees is good for you. They are here to help you. I, yeah, I, don't, I, I listen, I, I, I'm a manly man, but I don't think I can handle the dose that you were putting out. Um, I oh. I need to go. Um, maybe you just need to rest. Okay, go, go, okay, okay. And I I go over to my my little bush. <laughs> you just conk where out. I'm like I'm I'm freaking and I just, out. And I just mumble <laughs> under my, my I just mumble like oh, weak. <laughs> maybe don't leave him by himself. Oh, I'm not right gonna there. go and look him. Um, we can see him. Just, I'm just vibing. You're just vibing. I'm very... I just don't give a fuck about the other two. I'll be very honest with you. I'm having a moment. We're having a moment. Having a moment. 
Well, with having a moment. She's injured. She's injured and I'm not. So I'm like, you know. Well, she's just still injured. Down. I'll keep I an eye know. on you. Like. And I'm she, can I just heal her or something then? You can you can heal. I imagine we're going to I imagine we're going to like long rest anyway. So right. either way it so will I can have just the heal same her. Action. That's that's why I'm like yeah. I'm Wait, like do we get to level up? I'll I'm like you just lay down. I'll sit here with you until you like pot came meditate and we're all good. You leveled up last session. <laughs> there are were like nine bodies on the floor. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We um, hold on, hold on. Yes, you can heal her, Sage, if you would like. Either way, she's going to regain her hit points. Well, but if you I'm want to do gonna... it... Yeah, mm -hmm. just for the sake of it, you know. I yeah. wanna... I, I see the wound and I'm like, do you want some bandage on that? Because I can do... I can... I can... You don't even need bandage, I can just fix it I'm for suspect. you. Suspect. Yeah. Um, it, it would be helpful, yes. Uh, okay, well... Give me your hand. And she looks Bye. at uh, Sage's hand briefly before still holding Reese's in hands. one hand. Um, and then takes her hand very, like, hesitantly. You can tell she's not one to touch people. Okay, that's okay. I'm not gonna hurt you. Um, so, should I do first level, or? It's all up to you. You're gonna regain your spell slots because you have an long rest. Yeah, I'm. I'm okay. I'm gonna go full. I'm. I'm not very happy about it. Hey, I'm that's, just that's helping us. your wife. I just, I just look a little fucked off. Second. Okay, second you look a little fucked wounds. off, but she's curing it. <laughs> second level. All right. Yeah. I'm not saying there anything. I'm just like fifteen. All right. <laughs> Perfect. So that's fifteen points of healing, and that puts her almost at full health. Wonderful. And so okay. she, you, take, uh, you take her hand and just this warm glow radiates and kind of like a soft summer-like breeze, despite it being spring, um, kind of flows through the, the camp as uh, her, the wound that she had from the tusk had started to heal up um, and close on itself. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Anytime. Oh, uh, gently let go of her hand. Wonderful. And that's where we're going to call it for the evening. With the actual evening, as everyone is able yeah. to uh, get to sleep and take a long rest. We do that now? Yes. Go ahead. Take your long rest. Done. Perfect. I wore the beard the whole time. You did. I'm very impressed. Uh, yeah. How's everyone feeling? Awesome. And s <laughs> I, I knew that I had a feeling either Nicole or Reese would not like Sage or be super sus of her, one or the other. I didn't I expect it being Reese, to be fair. I thought it'd be Nicole, and she seemed way more accepting. I think Reese is just distracted. Reese is definitely distracted and also <laughs> having an existential later. crisis. <laughs> yeah. But I love just the Dario that he just was like thinking he was gonna die. Yeah, Dario's high as fuck, boy. Sometimes oh. it happens. So is the yeah. I've Dario had having night terrors. Before. Oh, you should have made us roll for it. That would have been good. <laughs> ah, well, next time. Oh, next yeah, time. I wasn't true. expecting Lunar to be like I we're getting high. fucking high, pulling out the bong. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay. Hey, uh, custom made, homemade, oh baby. I got this. Yeah. Made I'm out of a imagine, Coke imagine, bottle. Imagine offering, imagine offering Reese like drugs in front of her wife, and then being confused when she's like, "No, that, like." <laughs> After she poured I'm, out a bottle of alcohol, I'm trying to make things better, not worse. But so, I didn't really pay attention to the conversation. <laughs> yeah. So I just no, no, it's like, good. I love it. No. Yeah. So yeah, that wraps up our evening today. Um. I'll be back tomorrow uh, for some either Catherine or Fire Emblem. Who knows? Um, but it'll be a good time. And uh, for everyone new here, also thank you for all the follows and just your kind raids from both Mr. Toskos and Ben. Y'all are amazing. I really appreciate it. And uh, just a quick 
kind of what goes on here. We play D and D on sa uh, Sundays at 6 p.m. EST. It's a really good time. Uh, I'm gonna be trying to do more one shots during the week if I can manage it, but this is our for sure slot no matter what now. Um, otherwise, I play uh, like Fire Emblem. I'm playing Catherine right now. I like games with stories. I also occasionally play Fortnite though. Um, that's really it. So hello, formally everybody. Um, but that being said, let's find some, speaking of raids and all these awesome raids, let's find someone to raid. Let's go. I thought Daria could handle the the trees though. You know, you Dude, you, you smoke that so shit highly all day. Four twenty. Now <laughs> I he... would know Sage wouldn't know that, but you know. Legends. You gotta keep it. Gotta keep it interesting. You gotta do stuff that you know the opposite of what everybody's thinking. Sometimes I think Dario I cannot handle his weed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so we're gonna we're gonna go raid actor Pat, who is playing Rise of the Tomb Raider. I Ooh. really enjoy Tomb Raider game. Um, and so if you guys could all say hi to him, that'd be really cool. He does a lot of really cool stuff, likes Zelda games a lot as well. But I think it's a great place to send you all off on to. Also, he did like a like YouTube video that I watched like a lot as like a young teenager. And then like we found him randomly on Twitch, like not knowing it was him. But if you and if any of you guys know the Firefly rap from the like Firefly TV show and Serenity, um, that's what he he did that. And it was like a huge viral video. I was like, I know that rap by heart because I watched it a few too many times when I was like 14. So we do that's a really cool. Vlog? Come we back, do, come back. Uh, <laughs> Nathan Fillion, hold oh on. We need it. <laughs> um, so please go send him some sweet, sweet love. Uh, so raid actor Pat. Um, as usual for D and D raids, I will not be joining the raid. I'll be poking in for a second, but I'm going to be chatting with all my players, making sure everything's going good. But until next time, have a wonderful evening. It was wonder. It was great meeting you all. And good night. Hopefully Lara doesn't fall off of the stick she's on right now. So. Good night. <laughs> Bye. Bye.